What's cracking with it? What's good with it in the hood with it? Lifetime. Lifetime, like a lifetime show. Hey, what's up, Alfred? First one in here, bro. West, I see you, bro. Respects, brother. How you doing, man? Max Ryder said, what's up, Guns? What's up, brother? How you doing? Raymond. Raymond Sistos. I see you, man. Did I say that right? Alfonso Rodriguez is CV3 Canton tapping in from work. Hey, what's up, brother, man? I hope you're having a great day at work. Luis Tamayo. Hello. How you doing, sir? Fan first. Guard. East Bay NorCal is in the building. What's up, Canal? Mr. KC says, yo, bro, what's up? 11B Danny, what's the word, bro? What's the word on the curb? How much love? Rick says, what's up? Raymond says, yup. East Bay North Council, what's good, my boy? Shit, not much, bro. Kicking back. I put the bright lights on me today. Mm -hmm. Tony strikes again, huh? East side player. Saludos, Mr. G. Ricardo uh, Moreno's in the house. Jose Romero. Romero says, damn. Artie Reyes, saludos. Ty Stomp, Austin, Texas, tapping in feed, Miss Style. Man, shout out to the homeboys from Texas. Hey, what's up, Tracy? How you doing, girl? Tracy Saldana is in the house. Shout out, respects. Colorado, Jose says, only six likes, though. Man, hit them likes. In the meantime, in between time on your way in, Luis Aguilar, what's up, brother? The old goat is in the motherfucking Chante. Raja says, aloha to guns from Hawaii. Hey, that's right. What's up, my brother Slayer? You got your coffee in hand? Then you know the master plan. What's up, bro? Davis said, what's up? About the local boys. I owe you one. Says, orderly. OG, what's that? A modelo? Nah, that's a no sugar. Zero sugar, seven up, homie. Zero sugar. Junior Vizcaino. Saludos, carnal. What's up, brother? East Bay North Cal said, this year is going to be going by hella quick. Yeah, it's already uh, March 5th. Sliding by, bro. This month is crazy. Tomorrow's my daughter's birthday, man. My, my little baby's birthday. Pacific Brave says, what's good? Six years old already. Fast. It went by real fast. The phone number says, some dude told me it's saying a Chicano word. Um, Ese has been around for a long time, bro. Jeremy says, what's up for Morgan? Hey, how you doing, brother? What's up with the Pacific Northwest? Pacific Brave says, what's good? Uh, JW0, happy birthday. Yes, man, it's happy birthday to her. Tomorrow's her birthday, man. The shit goes by so fast. Six already, and that's my baby. Thank you, man. I appreciate that, Ty Stomp, Tracy, uh, Slayer, you know, the little one. She's about to have a good time. It's going down. It's going down. So what's up with you guys, man? What are you guys into tonight? Let me uh, do that over there. I appreciate all the hint there tapping in, man. I'm tired from work. A torta sounds good right about now. You ain't lying, bro. Slide one my way, homie. I know you got them all. East Bay, North Cal. Mm. Chris, North Idaho in the house. What's up, brother? Respects. Funk lover says, yep, I know this. I know what you would have said in that situation. I thought of you in that situation. Empire Davis is tapping in from San Bernardino. What's cracking? Man, shout out to the IE. You got girls and boys. Just four girls, bro. I never got blessed with a boy. You know, I think God said, hell nah. <laughs> we ain't trying to reincarnate you. Um, but my daughters are, are, you know what I'm saying? They're the shit. So I'm happy with that. I'm chilling like a villain cruising. That's right, Slayer. Looking for some mamacitas. Oh, you're going to find them. They're out there, bro. Ricardo Moreno, what's up, man? Hey, gracias, carnal. Isa Pierce says, I got them badass. Or there's some bad, there's some beautiful women everywhere, man. But you you ain't lying, man. Um, I used to function with a chick out of IE, and she was bad. Jeremy says, tacos. No way. I have three daughters, too, dude. Yeah, I got four of them. What's happening tonight, though, Esse? Nothing much, bro. It's Tuesday night, man. I'm just going to kick on back and watch the Grinch, you know? Uh, girls are hard to raise, homie. Got two myself. Yeah, they're a little different, bro. They're a little different. You got to be a little protective. You know, Daniel Gonzalez had to jump on the live. That's this. He was cracking. What's good with it, homie? Chilling, kicking back, watching your crazy ass videos, enjoying a nice cigar. Much respects from New Mexico. That's right, man. I appreciate that. Uh, Wanna walk out west? Where should I go? No one knows, does they? Uh, Grace, wherever, bro. It's all good out west. Rodney Andrews says, happy birthday to your daughter from Wyoming. Thank you, man. I appreciate that, bro. Victoria, Texas is in the house. The 361 in. It's tapped in. Big Jerry says, Cuba Sereno is in the house. Got an gunner. Hey, what's up, brother? Shout out to Sereno. Hotter than a motherfucker over there in the summertime. But a lot of respects, man. Definitely. We got 99 real ones in the building with 39 likes. Make sure you hit that like on your way in and out. I appreciate that. My boy, Jesse J. 
Big ass Jay Cox, man, has entered the building. Big Jesse Jay Cox is in the motherfucking house. What's happening? Kevin Rios says, saludos from Bakersfield. I'm going to go to Bakersfield when I parole. My homegirl got her baby boy on the way. I'm trying to help now because her baby daddy uh, is on a, took a whole different route. Yeah, you know, it should be happening, bro. It sucks. What's up, Raina? Yes, happy birthday to your little queen from Tulare County. Hey, shout outs, respects. Hey, Raina from the 559. Thula County is in the building. What's up, girl? Where's the like button, G? I'm hoping you can find it, brother. Make sure you hit it. I appreciate that. Hey, Boosters. Hi, Gunner. How are you, sir? Glad to catch another live essay. Hey, gracias. I appreciate you, homes, for tapping in and showing support. More de what's on. I just did 12 lineas. What's good, guns? You went for the 12-pack right off the top, huh? Fuck it, bro. A little gram. A little gram and a can of spam. Eastside Player says, I'm moving to Bakersfield. Can you tell us the story about that saying? Eastside Player, that's from American Me. You don't remember that? That, uh... That movie, when Little Puppet says, I want to, I don't want to be from Boop I want to get out and move to Bakersfield. <laughs> Your boy Ryan is going through some wild stuff. It's all over YouTube. Um, yeah, Ty Stomp, I seen that. Everything is placed where it needs to be placed. B says, Gunsmoke. And B, hey, what's up, Gunsmoke and B tapping in. What's up, B? How you doing, man? Gunsmoke, what's up, brother? Uh, hey, homeboy, I'll be in San Francisco in two weeks. I'm taking my son to Alcatraz. What's good to eat at the wharf? Well, you know, right now, hey, everything's good, bro. Um, there's a couple good little spots, but I'm gonna be honest with you, brother. Um, get you a bread bowl, homie, with some of that clam chowder. That clam chowder and that bread bowl uh, is fire. Some of them fish and chips. But hey, to be totally honest with you, bro, um, a lot of spots off the wharf are better. I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna be honest with you, bro, right off the top. Hey, what's up, uh, Raina? Says my brother is a pastor in Bakersfield. That's right, girl. Uh, Jackie Hernandez, what's up, girl? How you doing? Kevin Real says Bakersfield is not as bad as they say. It's chill, low key. Now Baker's is cool, bro. Bakersfield grew. I remember when it used to be small. It blew up. It blew up like in the mid nineties. Uh, Double R. That's right. I'm still here. You remember that shit tapping and slapping one time for the Mizzen. What's up, bro? Uh, I love how you come up with your rhymes. I grab in a can of spam. I'm dead. <laughs> the fun lover says this chicken is way better than beef, huh? I, I think it's uh. I don't know, bro. I mean, it depends on your skin color at this point. I like uh, burritos de carne asada or, or lengua, bro. I just had tacos. I just made some tacos uh, earlier. I had Taco Tuesday, like the white folks, right? That shit was bomb. Crab claws are good. Oysters, if you like them. Yeah, I fucks with it, bro. I like all seafood except for like tuna. I don't, I, I never fucked with tuna really. I mean, I ate it if that was the only thing to eat, um, but nah. Ezequiel Rivera, did you see our mom? Uh, Amado Vargas, Fernando Vargas' son challenged Sean Garcia to a fight in the undercard of Haney Ryan. Ooh, wee. Yeah, man. I like Fernando uh, Vargas' son. I think he's I think he's good, man. I think he's got a good career. Happy birthday to the little one, Esther Daniel Gonzalez. I appreciate you. Um, your daughter just turned eight this past January. Having a little girl is a whole different trip. Volatile. Yeah, bro. And I've been doing it since I was 19 years old. So, um, man, I've been, it's like every fucking decade I have a new daughter. Hey, that Norte video you dropped today was feed by say, gracias, bro. I appreciate that. Do you know much about East Palo Alto? Is it dangerous there? At one point in time, it was the most dangerous city in California, EPA. It was the murder capital of California, like back in the 90s. Um, there's a lot of Usos there, man. A lot of Tongans. Um, a few Northerners as well. Uh, you know, I don't know about nowadays. I haven't been to EPA for a minute, bro. But I know that EPA at one point, yeah, the wiggle was real out there in EPA. The Woods brother has uh, has tacos too. That's right. Tacos, brother. Uh, Got to get them tuna sandwiches in for the muscle gains. Much love, dog, from Santa Ruta. Junior Velasquez, what's up, Carna? How you doing? Shit, I say I'm Chicano, uh, but I like chicken burritos better than beef. Yeah, to each their own, bro. You know what I mean? Just savor the flavor. It'd be good. Chrysler Technician says, poor Ryan Garcia got done up by the Illuminati. And I think Rai Rai is going to be all right, bro. Um, I think it's all propaganda and drama, man. Um, the fight will go on. For real, though. For real, though. She's the girl in the movie, and I'm the hero. What's good, though, the gooch? Ty Stomps says, tacos and cervezas. Yeah, with me, it's tacos and 7-Up. I changed. You ever think about calling boxing fights? I tap in for sure. You know, um, the homies were getting at me about calling the Ryan Garcia and uh, and Devin Haney fight right here uh, live. And I was thinking about it, man, but that's totally up to you what you guys are into. You know, that's totally up to you guys. You know, wait up, man. Uh, Robert says, let me see. Let me get rid of this cat, bro. We don't need no weird shit up in here. 
Exactly. That's why I asked about EPA because I remember that it was the most dangerous. Yes, it was, brother. It was definitely uh, popping back then. I had a homeboy out of there, Rico, little Rico, man, from uh, EPA. And he was Puerto Rican, little Puerto Rican, Norteño, man. He was with the shits. I love meats, uh, drapes, tacos, 310, man. Santa Monica is in the motherfucking house. Guns, what's up? Big Abel Chrysler says, I was a hater on your channel in the past. Fuck it, bro. Keep doing your, bringing your great content. No one can knock that. Hey, Chrysler Technician, that's you, bro? Is that you? I thought that was you. I remember, bro, you said some pretty harsh things in the past, brother. But again, man, I don't hold it against you to each their own. You said what, what you felt was in your heart at that point in time. And I'm just glad to see, bro, that you're uh, supporting, man. Thank you. I appreciate you. I don't, you know, I ain't never switched up, bro. I'm, I'm going to continue to do me. No haters allowed out there local. Now, that's why he got biznounced. Alan McCoy says, uh, have you done any fishing yet? Not quite yet, bro. Next month. Next month. Uh, it's fishing time. I'm going to snatch so many bass up out that water, bro. Do a boxing watch party with you being the commentator. Yeah, that's what we're going to do, Ezekiel Rivera. Yeah, we're going to do that, man. Would you guys want to do that? Hit a one if you think that's uh, liable and viable. Hey, thank you, Chrysler Technician. I appreciate that, bro. No hard feelings, homie. And the beat goes on like a whisper song. Saludos from uh, Rosarito Baja. I hit that like button. Year 2024. I'll see you, my brother B. Thank you so much. Alan Terone, uh, Alex Terones. What's up, brother? Davis is yo, bro. Great videos. Thank you. I dropped a couple of them today. Um, wait till tomorrow. I think tomorrow you guys will be pleasantly surprised as I drop some some new shit. I got some whole different type of shit. Now, I said corn or flour tortillas. Homes corn off the top. I'm Mexican, bro. Hey, you already know. Uh, Chuyi, you quit drinking, bro? Yeah. Yeah, I, I did that, man. You should do vlogs, G. Uh, more than what's on, I got a lot coming this year, bro, 2024. You know, I mean, stay, stay on the grind and the lookout, bro, at the same time. Hey, what's up, Everlasting Base? You got the CR in the crank. Ha, 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 ha. Drop it like it's motherfucking hot. BS. That's right. The bees in the house. Because that bees in the trap. Be bees in the trap. Ty Stop says corn and flour tortillas all day. Yes, sir. Yeah. Um, I mean, if the flour's there, bro, but corn's my go-to first. Freddie Lopez, do you have any stories on Humboldt County? I've done some work out there. That shit ain't no joke. They got the wrong rules. Yeah, them, them woods out there, brother, move differently. Out there, it's coffee, meth, and good good bud. Tokes AD says, gun gun. I do, I do though, brother. Chuyi says, that's what's up, bro. Jeremy says, flower all the way. Ty Stop says, Norte, sir. I know. Damn. That one don't even claim North anymore, but do it for him, eh? Miguel says, que onda, guns? Just got out from holiday. Don't like the slow money, but it's for sure money. Can all stay up. Carne y chili con papa. Sorry, no tortillas. That's right, man. Get your grub on. Mm. Cairo, 408, Everlasting Base. Big Gio says, how is the East Coast gun? Oh, I'm not on the East Coast at this point, bro. I'm still on the West. But um, I've been out to the East Coast, and it's, I mean, it's different, but I like it. You know, I like to travel, homie. I like to see a little bit of everything. I've always had love and support since day one. Just because you've always been up front and straight with it. Not going to lie, though. I didn't know if you was going to be able to bounce back after that AC mistake. Bro, I bounced back like a motherfucking thumbtack. Shit happens. You know what I'm saying? I made a man's, made peace with myself and kept it pushing. And you see now, bro, this is the small channel. We're doing things. Imagine uh, when the big channel gets back on. Uh, ooh, wait, it's over. Uh, my goal is to have both channels at over 100K, man. I think we can get it that way. If you guys uh, participate and we just, we function. Yes, the Holy Trio, beers, meth, and good bud. There it is. My boy Smoke Dog, he, he has an altar to that shit. A shrine. Green enchiladas or red? Green. Morty, that what's one? Green chicken enchiladas are the best to me. Big Al from Blood and Blood Out is in the is in the pinta in the sky. Say R.I.P. Yeah, he's over there burning Mexicans for pork chops. Bounce back like like Tigger, says uh, Alpha. Ty Stops says R.I.P. to the homie Big Al. Big Albert, do it on your own time, Albert. That's it, dude. Really said I gotta stop looking at that girl at the gas station when she was looking at me. Shit, bro, you ain't got to stop doing nada, bro. And unless she tells you, you know, just don't be doing too much. Don't be a maniaco. Got a bag of kefi, brother. Oh shit, you know what it is. I used to live up in Arcata, Cali for a couple years, long ass time ago. That's straight up old school mountain law up there. Is that right, bro? I ain't never been up there. About those got three eyes and shit and a tally whacker. Uh, Sack is trash. Just put me two new. Uh, just put up two new videos. I'm a guitar god with the odds against him. Not one lesson. Hey, I'm at the trip out on it, bro. Is that the name of your channel? Sack is trash. Um, if so, bro, I'm gonna go support you. You know, I like listening to uh, live music. Yes, you did you, and that's why you're still rocking. You a strong individual, and you prove it like you stay true to yourself. Hey, thank you, Double. I appreciate the the wise words and the kind words, bro. 
again, UPS, SCS, always support you all day. Orange County in this motherfucking house. 110%. Yup, I'm on hate mode right now. Oh, wait. You're not motherfucker playing uh, Judas Priest albums, huh? Xbox or PlayStation? Um, I've always been an Xbox guy just because that's all I've ever had. I had one PlayStation 4. I gave it to my primo. Um, but to be totally honest with you, bro, I'm thinking about getting a PS5 one of these days and tripping out on it. You know, my daughter was asking me a, a while back, man, let's, we should just upgrade to the PS5. So when she says it, I have to fill it up with unleaded and do that. You know how kids throw it out there? My daughter's like that. She doesn't ask me. She just like kind of like throws it out there. I think we need to play a PS5. That means, dad, get off your ass and go get me a PS5. What's the worst prison in Cali? Uh, all of them. Bernardo Pulido. But if you go by popular demand, um, I would say High Desert or Salinas Valley at this point, bro. Those are probably... Um, the most dangerous, but I mean, any prison you're at is, is the worst prison, you know, uh, what's the one about Robert Judas priest is everlasting. Make you a homie. What's up? You read your fami uh, familia. You're going to go crazy. I on GTA five. Yeah. I fuck with it. I fucks with it. I'm not like tough bro. And doing that, all that online shit, but I'll play it. A gun. That was my excuse to get a PS five. Blame the kid. Hey, Amen. Did you like how I did that? I'm afraid to get a Nintendo DS because I need uh, less reason to be in the digital world. I feel you, brother. Those are any time, bro, that you find yourself uh, uh, pulled in the direction of digital, bro. <clears throat> you know, the less, the, the better. You know, that's why I don't even watch a lot of TV anymore. I try not to. Um, I do enough right here on YouTube, man, and TikTok and all that shit. Nah, it's it. Uh, I fuck with online. It's low key weird facts. Absolutely. What's up with you guys, though, man? We got 135 real ones in the building. 83 likes. Let's hit that like. Let's get it popping one time for your mind. I appreciate it. Monica Dela Cruz from Whittier has just entered the building. How you doing, young lady? I see you. Uh, Big Geo says, shit, I still have my Super Nintendo, bro. Super Nintendo Street Fighter 2 goes. I got the arcade game Street Fighter 2. I get into it every great once in a while. I'm not a I'm not a gamer like that, though. Mm. My boy Ty Stomp says he's waiting on the GTA 6 100. GTA goes, bro. My favorite one is San Andreas. That motherfucker right there goes. Let's get that like popping, man. Let's get it to a hundo. Uh, play tech in seven right now. It's a sack is trash. Jeremy, man, he threw up the... Is that the same worship? <laughs> what does that, does that mean? Rock on, brother? Uh, just came from Dubs Live, sending mine. G. Oh, is, is, Dub live, is Dubs uh, live right now, Salvador? Um, he said, where are you from? Mexico claiming uh, Sud, California, Por Vida. My muscles flex because I knew... Oh, oh, that's right. Everlasting Basically, you were singing a song. Dazzard, uh, Dazer Dab says, what's good, Gun? Hey, what's up, brother? LSR Becerra says, Kid Frost turned whack. So that's what I want to kind of talk about. Remember Spyro and Crash, Bandicoot? Devil horns, metal shit. It should be a girl Frost instead of Kid Frost. Nah, it's over. So Salvador, okay. I got four girls as well. You just uh, about to learn how to read between them lines. Adam and Cecil, you ain't lying. Phil D, what's up? So trip out. Um, Did you guys watch the Tony A? Shout out to Tony A, first and foremost. Chicano Express, what's up, man? You, you, hey, you said it when I said it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Jinx, you owe me a soda. Is that what they used to say back in the day? I like Tony A, man. You know, the Chicano documentary thing, that's water under a fucking, the LA bridge, right? And you got so many different things going on. But I seen that the other day I'm watching YouTube, bro, and it pops up in my feed. Kid Frost called in and, uh, Man, Kid Frost called him all types of dirtbags and pieces of shit, right? Um, I, 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 I commend Tony on how he held, how he held his composure, bro, because sometimes it's hard to do that. And isn't Kid Frost like 73 years old or something? Why? <clears throat> to do that, bro, over the phone, it just seemed, it just seemed a little childish to me, man. It, it seems like the more that I watch a lot of these legendary rappers and these legendary figures that we once praised, um, I got to take a step back like, bro, you know, it's just it's just wild, man. Much love, homie. I remember you slide through portals back in the day. Is that right, Alpha? Was you out there, bro? I did slide through portals regularly, bro. My ex was from portals. How do you guys get demonetized by playing music? Um, it's not you don't get demonetized by playing music. What happens, brother, is um, you get copyrighted. So basically anything that's made on the live, like say if someone sends me anything, um, if I was bumping music they'll find a way to try to get in my pockets. Kid Frost gets no pass in Stockton, says Everlasting Base. Mud Hooligan, Mark Puentes from Far, Texas. Hey, what's up, Mud? What's up with it, bro? How was work today? 
Hey, you're the type of author that doesn't even take your fucking helmet off when you go to sleep, huh? They're about to be sleeping in his neon vest. That's a real one right there. Monica De La Cruz, PlayStation 5 has audio description so blind people can play. Oh, wow. Hey, what's up, Monica? How are you and your husband doing, man? Tell them I send mines. Absolutely. The Chicano Express at Kid Frost with the J-Cat activities. Yeah, that was pretty... Um, that was a big letdown, man. It seems like letdown after letdown lately for Frost. And I know a lot of people uh, still support him. And he's brown, bro. I'm always going to support Frost in some capacity, right? But <clears throat> I think he took an elbow on that one, bro. He took a Randy Savage. I think Tony uh, was able to express himself a little bit more adultish, right? Who a better rapper, Frost or Mr. Capone? Oh, wait, damn, you put me on the spot. I'm going to have to roll with Frost on that one. You know what I'm saying? But they say Mr. Capone could do uh, tricks, tricks on a camel that you ain't never seen done before. What's your intro song in your videos? It's um, Brazilian Rhyme by Earth, Wind, and Fire, Jeremy. You, my boy, listening from Arizona. What's up, brother? How you doing, sir? Robert, how much you pay for the arcade version of Street Fighter? I lived on that game in 1992. Um, A couple hundred. Yeah, I paid a couple hundred, bro. But mine's not the big one, brother. I wish. It's the smaller one. Hey, KC fan, there she is. What's up, girl? Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate you. Thank you for popping it off tonight, setting it off. Um, how you doing, girl? I, um, I followed your friend. If you didn't get that message, uh, Freddie Lopez, what's happening with it? The Chicano Express, the Kid Frost used to kick it with Westside Windsor back in the eighties. Still has Familia in Santa Rosa from the V crazy how he ended up being a rapper from East Los. Ah, yeah. You know, I think, you know what I think Chicano Express and, and, and correct me if I'm wrong, brother. I don't know the whole history out there. I just know he came out with La Raza and everybody was bumping it, right? And he was portraying himself to be from East Los. I think East Los, when up up north, you know, us guys from up north, Northern California, when we think LA, we automatically think East Los or South Central, right? When there's more to it. And I and I learned that being in Nellis, bro, in, youth, in the Youth Authority, I learned about South Los and Nella, Sela, Harbor Area. You know, I learned about the Valle, SGV, SFV, all that. So, so Valle. Um, Orange County. And I think that that right there, uh, that education was that was instilled in me was good. But I think automatically, bro, he knew that and played off of that because East Los is so got so much history behind it. You know, that if he just came out as a rapper rapping for the Raza out of the East Los area, he would get more fanfare. Esse, have you ever met a Cuban and thought he was a brother? A couple times, Funk Lover. A couple times, bro. There's a couple Cubanos, are, they're very dark, bro. Um, I met some Mexicanos that are black. You know, I met black Mexicanos in Juarez, bro. Straight up. That's right, Jeremy. You like that? It's catchy, huh? We got 131 in the building with 102 likes. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys. What you guys into, though? Simon Marijuana Dreams. I'm so serious about my slinging. If you're slinging, you're my enemy. Was well, hella easy for me to make friends in OC, but in my town, everyone's too hard. That's the way it is. Sack is trash. You know, it's all about you, though, bro. How you perceive people and how you do you ever uh, see a black South Sider? Very uh, a lot of them, Robert. A lot of them, Holmes. Um, you know, I got history with black South Siders. Shadow from Grape, Watts Body with Grape, Casper from uh, Playboys. Um, just a gang gang of fucking uh, black South Siders. All solid as fuck, bro. Got to give them their props. Can we get the story of how you came up with your 65 Impala at Gunner? I bought it online, brother. You my boy, I bought it online. Um, you know, my first Impala I ever had was a 69, bro. Clean, shaved door handles, money green, uh, all black interior vinyl, a uh, top, black vinyl top, man, airbagged around. It was clean, bro. Triple gold ones. Um, and I had to get rid of it when my first daughter was born. And I went for years without an Impala, you know. Um, I kind of got out of that phase and I was a like Cadillac man and and cutlass supremes and regals, and then um you know, I came across some money, bro. I hit gambling a while back and I seen it online. It ran. It wasn't in the best shape, but the body was straight and the interior was all right. Um, and I've always wanted a 65 Super Sport, man. I could tell you guys a story hit a one about I did have a 65 Super, Super Sport for about a day, but then my dad pumped me for it. What's up, guns? You heard the leaked Ryan Garcia calls today. He don't seem right mentally, bro. I think everything is um, Rico. I think everything is uh, in motion just to. Uh, Pump the fight up. You know what I mean? To sell the fight. Us and OC love each other. Homes is all love. This is the fun lover. Mark Fuentes this is your gun. Whatever happened to Little Coner? Oh, that's a long story, Mark. That's a long story. I've heard a lot of different versions of that story, bro. And I don't want to slander that about this character right here. Um, because his brother uh um 
his brother's a very good friend of mine. Home shout out to the homeboy Turtle. Uh, you know what I mean from uh, uh, Dakota. I like an 87 Monte Carlo. Those go, bro. Bernardo Pulido, what's up? Yeah, too many haters nowadays. Can't give him no passes. Vasquez Familia, want to start this? Saludos. In the life, homie, I was laughing my ass off on that fat bunky being overweight. Myself, I keep it fresh. Puro, uh, that's right, bro. Chanel de Blue and Million Gold G. Hey, you got to keep it smooth and clean. Just because you're big doesn't mean you have to be big and dumb and big and ugly. Uh, I had a bag, 69 Apollo. It was cr a cruiser. Yeah, those are boats, bro. Jeremy, those are boats. My first car was a 1983 Cadillac Coupe de Ville. It was tough. Uh, my two favorite cities in California are Danville, California, and Irvine. That's right, brother. Those are a little different. Hey, Mark Fuentes, I got a lot of familia in Edinburgh, but what about the Cabrito in Reynosa? Big boy said, what up, Gun? Hey, bro, I seen a video on Johnny. Didn't, that, uh, didn't he do that to Doug? I think it's Johnny's choice substance is what's talking. Big boy. Um, yeah, we, we discussed that last night, bro. Um, hey, thank you, Chicano Express. I appreciate that, Carnal. I think to be totally uh, real with you, bro, I think Johnny um, is down on his luck, bro, and, and maybe someone, get, you know, cashed him out a little something, something uh, to make him feel that type of way. You know, I just, I trip out when my name gets brought up in this situation, bro. Like, uh, you know, several people are like, Gunner, I think he's talking about you. He may be talking about me, man. Um, but I don't know why. Again, that's why I dropped that um, interview I did with them so you guys could hear it from his own mouth exactly how he was feeling. Now, why he's feeling the way he's feeling, I can't call it, bro. Um, but again, I, like I said, I'm going to reiterate, Dubs uh, is a solid dude, bro. It would never bow down or get punked over a phone uh, by no one, I'm sure. Salutes, Gun wanted to stop by and show love. Shout out from Oklahoma. Benjamin Clem, I see you. Home Benjamin, I see you. Luis Aguilar says, I was into 59 Impalas. My last one got ripped off. At, Gun at Gunner, I got a one by 52 Chevy Deluxe. Damn, you my boy, that motherfucker's clean, huh? You know, I've always wanted a 59, uh, 57 Chevy, bro. Always wanted one. Cherried out. My first car, 96 Impala. SS brandy wine, red candy. I was known for it on the Michon. Hey, Vasquez Family, I think I seen that car before, bro. Candy brandy wine, huh? You know, I was out there in the I was out there in the city wiggling a lot, bro. Gunner, how do people stay in shape in the whole since they sit for like 23 hours? Uh, because nobody sits, CA. You know, at least you're not supposed to if you're functioning. Um, you put yourself, you get yourself into a rutina, bro. You know, you work out a couple times a day, a few times a day, man, if you're bored. Have you talked to Spanx to see how he feels about Johnny's situation? I have not, brother. I have not, to be honest with you. Um, the last time I tried to call Spanky, bro, um, I don't know if it was the same number or not, bro, because it never got picked up. SC, you should move to Cuba. Yeah, I, I mean, do they got now guys over there? Yeah, I hope Ryan gets it together before the fight. I want to see him land that left hook. You ain't lying, Ty Stomp. You know, I got money on it. If I was a kid, if I was Kid Frost, I wouldn't support SPM. I, hear, I heard that, brother. Vasquez Familia, that's right. Mark Fuentes and some tripas on the disco. Kamai Shadow, what's up, brother? How you doing, sir? Hey, I got that last night. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. Jail Conley, hey, as always, man. What's up, mate? I appreciate you, my brother. How you doing out there, man? Alan McCoy says, I got a 98 Z71. Oh, well, you're trying to stun on us, huh? Mm. You ever see someone get fat in the hole? Not really, bro. They don't feed you enough. Um, I've seen people uh, uh, get out of shape in the hole, though. You know what I mean? But as far as uh, get fat, if you're a functioning Northenio, bro, um, you're not going to ever get fat, homie. You, I mean, there's big bonded people that are fat, but uh, disculpa me, right? Hey, what's up, Ezekiel? Mark Winters, that's right, homes. What you think about the rapper Haystack, Mac and Millions, man, out of fucking Hayward? Yeah, he goes, bro. Gun smoke. I, I fucks with Haystack. Tough. That's a badass white white guy right there. I said, have you ever seen a black Sureño and a black Norte meet each other? Yeah, I actually seen them uh, take a head of fade. Um, when I was in um in Fred C. Nellis and YA, um, Shadow from Watts, from Watts Vario Great, bro, he uh, he went heads up with uh, Cisco from San Fran from 24th, Holmes. Shout out to the homeboy Cisco. Do you have a clothing line, uh, bro? Not yet, big boy, but we're working on that, man. I got a homeboy from Sanjo that does, and uh, he's trying to put me on. You know, he's trying to put me on, on, on the road. What does the blue wrench icon mean? That means, brother, that you're a, a moderator on my channel. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it means. Oh, that's cool, uh, uh, Mr. Uh, whoever the fuck you are. I'm going to go ahead and get you out of here, bro, because we're, we're not with that program. We don't use other people's pictures. Uh, is some prison food is good or all gross? Nah, there's some good prison food. Yeah, bro, people get the game twisted, bro, thinking that everything is bland or 
You got to understand a lot of these guys that are the cooks, they're lifers. So they're going to make it like they want to eat it, bro. I think where it gets watered down is because they make so much at a time. But um, there's a few different items, bro, like chicken night goes, you know, that big chicken hits uh, hamburgers. I mean, they taste like AM, PM hamburgers, but the motherfuckers go. Does Casper look still wrap? Uh, you're talking about Casper look from uh, Gonza? I think he does, bro, to be honest with you. You ever see a black wood gunner? Uh, nah, uh, uh, yeah, nah, I ain't never seen one of them. That's different, brother. Hey, there's a wood right now. He just spit out his coffee. Now, hold on now, brother. The only thing blacks wood's like is coffee, <laughs> right? You know what I mean? Ezekiel says, wrenches get on it. Gunsmoke says, I kind of feel like he put jelly roll on. Um, perhaps, bro. A jelly roll was tied back in the days. He switched his whole persona up, huh? So what do you what do you do when you are behind the door for months? Um, hard time. Hey, Joe, what do you do? Um, you read, you educate yourself. You know, I was into um, I like a lot of nonfiction books, but also a lot of educational books. So what I would do, man, it was I study my little Bible, do my thing, read an educational book, then a, a, a inspirational book, then a, a fun book, you know, just a little bit of everything. Waiting on merch, gun smoke, and, and I will support. Thank you, B. We're gonna get on that. Uh a black wood. Yeah, Clayton Bigsby is a black wood. <laughs> this is a Chicano Express. Mud Gunner, I didn't work out. I didn't work today. A lot of snow came in, but we went fishing and caught a monster. Wish I could forward the pictures. Yeah, bro. Hey, you gotta hit my email, brother. Hit me on my email. If it's major, hit me on my pager. Get them goofies out of here. Yeah, they're gone. Uh, hey, my boy Robert says, LOL, a black wood. You know what I'm saying? I know about a black and mild, but not a black wood. Uh, Daniel Gonzalez says, I, in fact, one of the videos I got is very controversial tomorrow. So tap in, man, if you guys want to see how the gun gets down. I used to come out sucked up from the damn hole. Only place I ever gained weight in solitary was at North and Santa Fe working the level system. Yeah, hey, bro, I was in this one oil. Um, they fed you fucking crazy. It was in Oregon locked up, right? They fed you fucking crazy, bro. Triple... That, hey, they'd serve right there, like right in front of you. So they just pile it on it so much that it would they stuff it in your tray slot and shit would fall on the ground. But hey, shit, it wasn't nothing to pick it back up. El Guero, Paisa story, what's up, Gunner? Say, what's up, Gunner? How you doing, sir? Uh, I heard a story of a German guy from Germany who claimed Paisa and they accepted him. No cap. Was that right? Yeah. Hey, you know, there's, um, when you're from different countries and shit like that, bro, you can actually get in with the Paisa car or the other car. And a lot of them like to go towards the Paisa car just because they see the way that the Mexicanos move, bro. And, they, and that's just more their flavor. T-shirt idea, collective clip written over top of magazine clips with bullet holes. Big boy, man, send me a, a send me a, a, an idea. I like that, bro. A visual. Hey, Connor, get the merch. 714 will support you. Meet Jelly Roll in Tennessee before his start. He was real humble back then. Yeah, I, I believe he's humble now, too, B. I believe he's humble now. I just believe that, you know, um, he's like the... The white lefty gunplay, meaning, I mean, success came overnight and he's and he's, he's just doing what he do. What does the menudo thing you say mean? Guns, Manny, um, I've told a gang of people that plenty of times. I'll tell you, though, brother, because you asked. So I had a homeboy, bro. He was a knockout artist and he'd knock motherfuckers out so hard, bro, that he'd say, hey, that about the right there. He'd be snoring. <sighs> he says, that about is going to need menudo in the morning because he's going to feel like he has a headache. Mm. So that's why I always say in a menudo style, basically a knockout style. Um, basically I'm knocking the, uh, the shit out the park. In my opinion, Frost didn't handle that correctly. The conversation should have been private, not on the internet. Lakers. I agree with that hundred percent. Cameron says, Gunner, do you ever get butterflies in your stomach before you release a video? No. Why, why would I do that brother? Yeah. Why, why would I get butterflies in my stomach? homie? I'm not a chick. Did you know bones out of Modesto? No, I knew bones out of Merced. Uh, Hey gun. What do you think about the boy K frog from Florida? I've watched a couple of his spills. Not bad, bro. Um, I don't watch them consistently, consistently just because, you know, um, Florida politics are way different from California. So I can't really identify, um, but I support from afar. Yo, wet wipes to your face. We out here. What's good? Gun gun pack, man. I see you. I've met black skinheads. Says Jeff Hunt. Oh, yeah, there's black skins, bro. Um, woods, though, is a different. There's a difference between woods and skins, you know. Um, but there are black skinheads not in the California system. Because those are a different type of skinheads. But, you know, some of the skinhead movements originated from Jamaica. So a lot of people don't know that. Esse, have you ever met a Jewish Norte? Yeah, I got a homeboy that's a Jewish Norte. It's right off the top. He's he's with the fucking activities, too. Would you agree that Bice's car have more power than the other's car? Power? Um, 
those are probably the two cars where you could, you know, do your thing, man. Um, I don't know, bro. It's, it's, uh, let me get this guy here. It's, uh, it's a fucking thing where it's hard to say, bro. I got a lot of respect for the Usos and the Asians as well as the Paisas. I think both of them guys are, are powerful in their own rights. Uh, gun supporters, Maha. I don't know. People make that wrong move. Chaos is how much is a cell phone in prison? Um, I don't know, brother. I haven't been in prison for a while. Geez, LOLC haters got nothing better than to hate. That's what they do, bro. It's like one or two guys, bro, that's right now living in his grandma's uh, trailer, you know, with nothing more to do but play with cats. Saludos, gun, Arby, sauce at work at lunch. That's right, Sam Romero, the Chicago Express, Kid Frost, been talking to Blue Nalgas. That's why we don't know how to, that's why he don't know how to conduct himself. I don't know who Blue Nalgas is, bro. But um, I hear you, my brother. You ever run across Powder from PNI? He was a real one. I've heard Powder's name before mentioned prior to YouTube. Um, he was. He was definitely somebody. Um, you know, and I've spoken to uh, a supporter, of, a very close supporter of Powder's since he came on YouTube, man. And uh, it was all it was all love and respect. They love using your picks. That's all good, Ty Stomp. Kibo, homie, what can an out-of-stater expect in a West Coast penitentiary if they have their home state tatted like a big Texas? Um, respect. You know, you're you're going to get what you give, Oscar, no matter where you're from. Um, who he's going to run with? Now, being from Texas, and if, as long as he's not a Norteño or a Southsider, um, pretty much he's going to run with the car where he falls out of. So if he falls out of Northern California, more than likely he's going to run with either Northern California or the Paisas. Um, and it, vice versa, if he, you know, he gets locked up out of L.A., then he's probably going to run with the Southsiders. What's well, cracking Gunner? And he's going to get a lot of respect no matter where he's from, bro. Uh, Pero Rojo, I see you. Kamai Shadow says they have an obsession. This is their obsession. It's weird, huh? Uh, Saludos, Gunner. Toyota or Honda? Yeah, I'm going to rock a Honda, bro, just because Hondas last forever. Mm. Pimp Vibes says, Ricky Sal, did Merced and Modesto have any type of rivalry? Never. We always got along good, bro, especially my barrio. And a, a barrio out of the west side called Four Corners. Um, a lot of my homeboys have primos that were from Modesto from Four Corners. So we'd wiggle go over there and chill with them all the time. There was never any static between Modesto and Merced. Um, I mean, one-on-ones. And, and if you ran into the wrong dudes, um, and it wasn't even city tripping. It was more so, hey, you fucking pinch my lady's ass type shit. Uh, we don't have much to do with Woods too. Unpredictable as a skin, you know the rules. Oh, I already know what it is, Joe. Uh, Blue Nalgas is Haters World Podcast. Oh, okay, I wasn't aware that that was his nickname. Augustine Robledo, what's up with it, man? Have you ever did time with Jamaicans? I used to work with hell of them. They're good people. Uh, I ran into a couple Jamaicans. They were um, considered non-affiliated blacks. Uh, good dudes. Didn't really chop it up with them. They were kind of uh, into their own trip. Never had issues with them, bro. But because we functioned right there on the same side of the yard with blacks, um, you know, I would see them have interaction as far as a good morning. But, um, yeah, you know, I can't tell you that they were the greatest people, but uh, the dudes I ran into, bro, were pretty solid. I said, have you ever seen a dude that acts like he's all hard in the streets? What's going to happen to him in the street? Um, you know, if he's hard, then he's hard, bro. Then he's going to do what he does. If he's not, he's going to get uh, popped like a fucking tire. Is it true the federal prison system is better than the state? I've never been to the feds, bro, but I heard the feds in certain areas, it's worse, you know? So federal prison is nothing to be played with. You know, a lot of people think, oh, man, they eat steaks in the feds and they got it going on because it's federally uh, uh, funded. The feds ain't no joke, bro. They'll butcher you in the feds. You know, that's a meeting of the minds. That's like when, you know, when you're young and you go to elementary school or even junior high school, middle school is what they call it now. And then when everyone gets to high school, it's like a little bit of everybody. Right. And it's now it's a whole bunch of new hint. And you meet new friends and new people, different philosophies just from different sides of town. That's kind of how the feds are. You got bottles from every different state, every different mindset. Bro, I used to spend time in Merced back in the 90s, but I was a kid. My grandmother lived by Applegate Park. Oh, you know what it is by the big rocket. Yeah, I had a pad right there by Applegate Park as well, right across the street. Toyota Supra is my shit, though. It's best car ever created by Toyota, bro. Hey, they're hard to find. They, I, know, hey, I know that they came back out with the new Supra, but the old Supras, them motherfuckers worth 100 racks. OG style 100. Have you seen uh, Doc Weiler stabbing incident? I have not, big boy. Is it on YouTube? 240SX is where it's at. That's right, man. We got 165 in the building with 126 likes. Fuck with your boy one time. Thank you. 
Did the Northerners lose the yards to the two fibers at San Quinn? I heard from these guys at work. Not sure. I don't know anything about that or even if it's true. That would never happen because North Daniels would never even see two fibers because two fibers are on an S and Y yards, bro, and, and active North Daniels are on um, GP yards. So <clears throat> that would never, ever happen. But I will tell you this. Um, yeah, that would never happen. I can't even tell you nothing other than it won't. It would never happen. Who are you fighting? You're fighting yourselves, Robert. Sack is trash, my mint caliber SRT for baby. That's right. I'll bet the woods allow someone who has half white and half Mexican. Oh, yeah, I've seen it, bro. I did a video about it. Yeah, they'll allow, uh, uh, you know, there was a lot of, um, there was a couple half Mexican dudes that ran Nazi lowrider, bro. Facts. I met woods that are half Mexican. There you go. Ty Stomp. Truth. So have I, bro. Folgers fun. Thank you, man, for contributing to my Folgers fund. Let's get the Folgers fund cracking, <laughs> says Cracker D. Thank you, brother. You know what I'm saying? I'm almost there. If you hit the lottery right now, what's the gun doing? Uh, blessing a whole bunch of people in this chat, man, just like they bless me. And then, um, you know, taking care of my familia. The only place they eat steak is at ADX Florence, and that's solely because they don't get cantina at all. Wow, Daniel, see, that's something I didn't know, bro. No canteen. Then man, the struggle is real. I heard that the... <laughs> In feds is different rules that in the Cali state is that the case then um yeah that's the politics i don't really get into robert some asian dudes from tango blast that's right man uh augustine says gunner what do you think about 600 i know he's a j cat but he turned uh two fade down by 21 and one from where um oh he turned down the fade i believe uh it's all the fades and bro it's just for views man i I believe, man, if it's that serious and you want to see someone, you don't have to record it. Just go see them, you know? Yes, Dubs made a video on it. It says, big boy, 22 Honda Accord. Uh, you ever been out of King City or Soledad or Grifas? Any of those little South Monterey, Monterey County towns? Yes, sir. Joke's up. Um, shout out to the homeboy Psycho from Grifas. I've been to Grifas, Gonza, um, all that little area. Yes, sir, bro. The the whole salad bowl. Uh, Bernardo Polito says, what you have to do to get an in tat? My cousin got it blasted on his back, but if you can't speak on it, it's good, big homie. Now, that's something I will speak on, bro. Um, what do you have to do to get one? Nada, you know. Um, but once you get incarcerated, bro, if your hand is asked to be raised, you'll raise it. Um, but, you know, you hear a lot of people, oh, you need to earn that tattoo as an orthenior man. There wasn't really there was some work that you weren't allowed to get on you. I remember for a long time we weren't allowed to get anything above the neck um or past the elbow you know um then when i was in susanville in 2006 uh, a wheel i came from pelican base and we can get tattoos anywhere and homies went crazy homies were getting active blasted on the back of their head and strive on their throat and all kinds of crazy shit uh i'm not a bully adrian zuniga man ca said there's a wood right now stirring up a cup of coffee like brother this sure is gonna taste mighty white i mean mighty good I got stopped in a car with two black guys. My friend said, two blacks and a skinhead. We are in trouble. They are. Not you, not you Joe. Why does YouTube advertise girl products on your commercials? Oh, I can't call it Captain Howdy. You know what I'm saying? You know, because they, they know that there's a lot of women in here that support the gun gun. Adam and Cece says, I ran a Toyota Camry 5, 16,000 miles. Uh, 16, 516,000 miles. Sold it only because it looked like crap. Yeah, they last forever, bro. Toyota Camrys, Honda Accords, all that last forever. Gunners. This guy is referring Bulldogs versus Two Fibers. He accidentally said Northerners. They are reintegrating Two Fibers with Bulldogs. Not going well, says Robert. Okay, yeah. Um, now, I could see that happening, man, because it seems like they're throwing Bulldogs on frontline status. They try to already integrate them with Northerners and Southerners. That didn't work out. Um, integrating them with Two Fibers ain't going to work out either. The Bulldogs function, man, and Two Fibers are with the activities as well. So, uh, yeah. I'm sure that there's a lot of bloodshed that's in the future. Nick Nicholson said, good evening, Gunner. All right, man, you have a good one, brother. Adrian says, Barone gone formal West Valley, bubble, bubble. Adrian Zuniga says, for real, though, for real, though. I heard you had to earn a face and head tat back in the days. Uh, maybe maybe so, man, but I never heard about that, Ty. Stop, to be honest with you. Mm. Go run into a wall. It's like the same. What up, Gunstero? Where's the tortas at? Shit, I'm going to try to get my show shit peeled back um, as soon as we're done here. Tacos are great. Hey, just tuning in. What's good? Ty Stomp says, hey, brother. Saw a guy riding a bike with a Hell's Angel jacket on him. Modesto. Hey, bro. You know what I'm saying? Hey, when all else fails, as long as he's on two wheels, he's getting it. Gunners, tell us what it feels like to answer all these questions. Is this tiring or is it fun? Feel like a job? Enlightening? Um, I love the interaction, brother. I love their interaction and I try to stick to my, you know, to my 10 toes and 
you know, answer what I want to answer and sometimes answer uh, things that, you know, I don't get the time to answer. You know, people got a lot of questions, bro. So I feel like, um, is it a job? Yeah, it's a lot of work, bro. It's a lot of work. And I, I do get tired. But, uh, you know, you guys are the ones that support me. You guys are the ones that watch my videos, bro. So I feel like I owe it to you to, uh, you know, answer some of the questions you want to ask. Uh, hey, Gunner, you watching WrestleMania this year? Yeah, bro. Does a fat kid love cake? You know I am, Augustine. Shit, I wanted to go to WrestleMania, bro. Uh, but I know when they have it in Vegas, I'll be there. What you want to bet? What's a two fiver? Um, Louise two fiver is a um a dropout, a dropout uh gang member from um from Southern California. They have a long history, bro. They're one one of the first dropout gangs ever started. You know, most of them were from Southern California. There are some two fivers from Northern California, but most of them were the majority of them were from uh, Southern California that came together. Uh, for self-preservation and protection against uh, active Southerners. Salutes from Corpus Christi, Texas. Dylan Rodriguez, what's up? Extend the intro. That shit slap. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Just go, huh? Just let it bump. You're a real one, brother. Thank you, Jeremy. I appreciate you. You should drop some merch. God, I definitely cop some. Thank you, DJ. I appreciate that. It'll come out of nowhere when it does. I remember my homie was trying to break up a fight with his prima on the bus one time with a crackhead, and the crackhead hit my homie. My homie hit her back. What would you do in that situation? Gonna Oh, hit a female? Yeah, and I, I ain't doing none of that, bro. You know, you know I'm going to turn my back on her because I couldn't pull the Mac on her. We love cake, says Vasquez Familia. Garrett says, Desculpame. What's up, Cuzzo? What you into tonight? What's up, Tater Tot? How you doing? Hey, girl, I don't know why YouTube, now that I can talk to you, I don't know why YouTube uh, erased your comment. They've been doing that on my channel. In this genre, um, there's key words that I guess YouTube feels some type of way about. I don't know. It's been like that. This, this genre is a little different. What was the store off our, our street in Merced that used to sell FUBU and Sean John back in the day? I think it's a Dollar Tree now. Off our street? Mm. Off our street. On the west side or the north side? Orderly Gunner. Pistolero is not sensitive to keep it up, perro. Uh, no, I'll do my thing, Captain Howdy. Where's the coffee, brother? Oh, it's in the motherfucking cocina. Uh, bears a falsehood gun. I was told someone passed. I still hear that vagabond. You're going to drop Selena video. Um, pretty soon Dylan Rodriguez. I'm trying to get the shit together on that, bro. What's the name of the song of your intro? I have it stuck in my head. Brazilian rhyme by earth, wind and fire. What's the latest on the playboy president? I have no idea, bro. I'm sure he's in the oil right now. Um, I don't know if the district attorney picked up the charges. If it's a murder case, bro, depending upon the evidence, um, He's done, bro. But I mean, he was already doing 60 years. He already picked up 60, you know, uh, when he was in L.A. County. So, yeah, that about done, man. And uh, it's unfortunate, man. That's the life he lives. But I mean, he's in his own now. He's trying to make 150 bucks. I don't know either. Says Tater Tot. It's all good, girl. Sometimes it does that. You just got to drop another line and, and it'll be on. Just ate an edible. Oh, shit. Because, oh, you're about to be vibing right now. Speaking of vibing, Pit Vibes says Ricky Sal says, have you ever seen 150 Northanians on one yard? No, I have not, brother. Not on one yard. If you if you count the Youth Authority and Carl Holton, there was about about 400 of us. And uh, yeah, oh man, you didn't have to. Uh, Blue, thank you so much. Be safe, be dangerous. Thank you, girl. I appreciate you, man. She supports for reals. Thank you so much. Um, you didn't have to. What's up, G from West End, Newark to El Chuco, Texas, Bash Bro Martinez. I see you, brother. What's up with it? I think the North says Chicano Express. Uh, YouTube auto mods typically blocks anything with profanity in it. Says Kamai. Absolutely. Hey, bro, when are you going to cook? Saludos. I made some tacos earlier. Hey, I dropped the, um, if you guys haven't tapped in, man, make sure you guys tap into my TikTok. I dropped the video on TikTok. Um, but I'm doing something this week, man. We're going to get back to the cooking and talking. You know, if you guys like that, hit a one. Hulk Hogan says, oh, brother. <laughs> What's up, Hogan? I see you, bro. What you going to do, brother? Gun, why didn't you fight Cholo Trucker Part 2? Uh, he didn't want to fight no more, Robert. I, I did. Uh, so I um, I wanted to uh, do it again just for the Hente Man. Um, and we talked about it. And first and foremost, shout out, respects to Cholo Trucker. He's a good dude, solid. Um, he wasn't into it, bro. He was just like, I, I just wanted to try fighting once. I did it once. I'm done. And, um, and that was that, bro. But we tried to make it happen, bro, and it just never happened. Um, but it's no big deal. 
Um, I love the cooking videos. I said, thank you, Ty Stop Gunsmoke. You should do a spill on Young Lay and the whole Unsolved Mysteries thing. I was going to do that one time, Gunsmoke. I might get back to that. Yeah, that's a trip, man. I know I know exactly what you're talking about. Shout out Young Lay, man, from Vallejo. Facts. A low rider or luxury car or truck, what you mobbing? Um, I like trucks, bro. <laughs> you know, I like trucks. Low riders, trucks. I've had a little bit of everything, bro. You know, for a minute, you know, I was a, I had a little range. Um, I've had a Mercedes before, all that, bro. It's no different than anything else you're mobbing. I love trucks. I think every man should own a truck once in his life. Love the cooking videos, bro. Thank you, Dreamers Lounge. She's the way the podcast is. What's good, Gun? It's been a minute. It has, sir. How are you doing? How are you doing, brother? It has been quite a minute, man. Uh, I appreciate you, bro. You got my support. When the weather gets nice, you need to go live, throwing out the queue. I think people would like to invite us to the Carna Asada live. Israel Trevino. One never knows, does one, man. I get invited to something in Fresno uh, this summer, bro, that I'm definitely pulling up to. We need to hear more about your Impala. It's a shit. I need to hear more about it, too. I'm broke. When I get money, I'll paint it, and then we're going to show it one time, and then I'm going to sell it, bro. You should do the soup you like. I had to look it up. It looks good. Oh, the abondigas? Yeah, that's some work right there, girl. But uh, if you want me to, I could. Breathing technique, says Adrian. This is how I breathe. <sighs> and I'm good. Remember when Hogan and Savage shot a promo where they said they're going to topple the Twin Towers and watch them crumble to the ground way before 9-11? They predicted that shit, huh? Remember when Hogan and fucking uh, Macho Man were all coked out doing that interview? Mean Gene was all fucking... Even Mean Gene was sweating, right? Then about the fuck... Come on, brother. Just shake it, brother. Macho Man was like, <laughs> Macho Man was all fucking yayed out. Best spread ingredients. Um, here's the key. You guys want to hit a one if you guys want to hear the key to the best spread. I'll tell you guys. You know what I'm saying? I don't never see anyone use it. Look, I've never seen it. All these spread videos I've seen on YouTube, I've seen Big Boy do spreads. I've seen uh, Rest in Peace, uh, 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 Money Science Way do spreads. I've seen Dubs do a spread. I've seen myself. Renegade Media, every cat, Box, Big Box did it. Um, so many different prison genre channels and, and other people do it, right? Um, but they've never used this ingredient and this, and you could ask Dubs. If I'm lying, I'm dying. Go ask Dubs, right? Um, the fucking Cactus Annie frijoles, the, the, the dried beans, the, the ones that you just throw in water and they bubble, those are what you need. Those right there change the whole complexion of the fucking spread. And no one gets them. They're on Amazon, man, but they're expensive. You know, I'm going to do a spread with some of those. Saludos, Gunner. Uh, hey, what's up, Joanna? How you doing? Still at it. Much love from Stockton. Hey, likewise, girl. Got a lot of love and respect for you. Thank you so much. Randy Savage was always tripping because he knew Elizabeth was smelling. Elizabeth was bad, bro. Look at Gunsmoke's chilling right there with his lady. He still said it. Fill it up with a letter. He's confident. Hey, Elizabeth was bad, bro. I love me some Elizabeth. Pepperwood here, brother. Respect to the Raza, brother. Love the wood impersonation, I say. <laughs> That's right, Greg. Hey, got nothing but love for you, man. Shout out to the woods, man. You vaultas are crazy with the sword. You want Russell Wilson on the Raiders? I mean, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind, bro, just to see what we do with him. To what degree of tor uh, tortillisms are we talking, gun? Uh, 290 at least. Yup, I used to eat those like chips, homie. Those motherfuckers are good, bro. Those beans are the best. My girl was hating. She said, that isn't uh, machaca. <laughs> Uh, Hogan had lust for Elizabeth. Shit, now I need a coffee, brother. Hey, I'm telling you right now, when I start saying that, fucking about to start fucking jonesy. It's that itch, bro. You're like, fuck, that sounds good right now. Some house blend, huh? Hey, what's up? Uh, Chrome.com, uh, East, uh, how you say esports? I see you, homie. Just seen Lefty do a spread with his girls. It looks all bad. Yeah, Lefty, oh, it didn't look too good. You know what I mean? If your spread looks like cho uh, chorro, you're doing bad. She is fire, says B. Yeah, you ain't lying. Uh, I'd go to ancient Egypt. I would too. Hey, Gun, my work brother from Oklahoma, feed me white boy, never uh, tasted menudo. So one day we both came in crudo, but I had some menudo. So I gave him a taste of it, and he said it tastes like cow stomp. <laughs> hey, you know what? My brother-in-law is white, right? He's a, he's a solid motherfucker, straight biker. Good evening, family 209 love. Uh, Rajanil, what's up? Hey, man. Uh, big iron Byron. Thank you, man. I send my utmost love and respect. Full blast. Appreciate gun. Keep on shining. Likewise, sir, man. Keep doing your thing. Thank you so much. I appreciate you, brother. Uh, I would die. I would did better doing a China Mac and Crip Mac adventure show with you and doves. You know, we talked about that, Robert, and we'll get back to my brother-in-law thing in a minute, but we talked about that and we had big plans, bro. Um, you never know what you're ever going to see in the future, man. You just never know in this world. This world is crazy. Do you own any cowboy boots, Gunner? I do, CA. I do. 
I do, man. I get my motherfucking, uh, my Los Buki on from time to time. You know, I trip you out, bro. And you know how many hyenas I put when I throw those boots on and I go to the bilat? Shit, bro, because I'm all light-skinned and shit. I'm all cut up. Chicks, ladies love me a long time in that motherfucker. Gunner, that was a great video for you and Johnny. Unity and positive vibes are always awesome. You know, it was. It was. And I wanted to reiterate that and throw it out there for the people that have never got a chance to watch it. Um, is there gators in California? There wasn't my homeboy's backyard. But no, on the regular, regular, I don't think there is. Essie, you should go to Jalisco, Mexico. Um, I got familia out of Juarez, bro, in Zacatecas. So that's that's the area I frequent. Um, but I heard Jalisco's popping. Just curious, have you ever been out to Utah? I've been through Utah, not out to Utah, bro. But you know what? You know what I have? I'm lying, bro. I have been out to Utah. It's, it's a little different. My boy says she got to be a little too something for me to do something. I'm going to steal that one, bro. That's a good one. Exactly. You know what I mean? She got to be a little 350 to keep it nitty. Saludos, Raza from the Big 619. Yo, Gun Gun, Frost for supporting that Chester. Fuck Frost for supporting that Chester. DeWalt only, I agree. Also, um, you know, I don't know if you guys watched uh, Tony, Tony A, the wizard, man, who I respect. I respect as a pioneer, man, in the in the Raza music game. And I respect Frost for that. You know, I he seems a little senile nowadays, man. I think he's got a, I think about this, got amnesia or some video. Orele, Hulk Hogan, love her long time. Menudo is my shit with the pata de puerco, tie stomp, man. Shit. About a month ago, one of my homegirls made a big old pot. Hey, Gunner, will you go on Indicted TV? Um, respects to Negra and her old man. But, you know, um, I don't want to put them in a situation where they, you know, get in any type of trouble. Hey, Gunner, do you ever make mariscos como aguachiles or ceviche? I do, man, and I make a bomb-ass cocktail. Uh, shit, my chero boots too, homie. Lizard skin, square toes. Shit, Daniel's ready to go. And then, hey, tell me, bro, some clean ass fucking five ones. Sass, you know, nice fit, bro, with some boots, little hat, shirt, little cajena. You're there. What up, gun? I was thinking, hey, what's up, Raul Rodriguez? Frost is old. He is, man. Pimp vibes says, how bad is it for Northenios in Fresno County Jail? You know, um, I have some Fresno Northenio homeboys, man, from West South Fresno, uh, WFN. And they have their own pod, homes. They function. You know, they do their thing. Uh, they keep them segregated from the Bulldogs. So um, I bet you it's pretty smooth. You know, they're just doing their thing. Um, there's a lot. You know, with the Bulldog situation, it's just <clears throat> I have an old school mentality with that. You know, I have an old way of thinking with that because I remember when Bulldogs were North Daniels And most of the dudes I fucked with were Bulldogs just because we were in the same area code, 209. Fresno used to be 209. So um, I have a lot of love for a lot of federal chatos. They still got love for me, um, but it's different. You know, it's different nowadays. What's up, guns? Hey, what's up, A18 Southside? I see you, Kana. What's up? I was thinking about the video where you got set up with someone on our side and you guys kept having to stop uh, the fight when the guard was walking by. Oh, yeah, you're talking about Ducky, the Vato Ducky. Um, that was in Carl Holton, brother. Yeah, they put us in the cell together in Carl Holton. And, uh, you know, it was what it was, bro. It was like, hey, whoever loses is leaving the cell. The phone lover says, Jalisco, is it because you uh, like skin homes all them white skins? I fuck with it. That's Miss Elizabeth. To you. That's Miss Elizabeth to you, mean Gene, brother. Hey, hey, what about when fucking, uh, Macho Man was a trip, huh? Hey, mean Gene, he'd be trying to fucking look at Miss Elizabeth's tits. He'd be like, hey, how you doing, Liz? And he'd be like, hey, brother. He'd say, oh, yeah, mean Gene, look this way. <laughs> that about was different, huh? Dig it. That was Mike Epps' new special. Uh, what's good, Gunnar Elwero? What's up, man? Saludos from Oesto. Enjoy the content. Hey, gracias. Crab salad or spaghetti? It depends, bro. If the crab is real um, and it isn't chorizo spaghetti, then I'll, I'll roll with the crab salad. But uh, that chorizo spaghetti kills it every time. Robert C. says both are so delicious. Outlaw Feminist in the house. Make sure you guys tap in. Support her. Uh, go tap into her channel. Like, subscribe, please. Um, I implore to you guys. She's uh, laced up. Very, very, very sophisticated and a smart woman. I've learned so much from her already just watching her videos. Sounds like someone steal. The paisas be asking me to take a pic with them at the quinceañeras when I throw the boots on homie Jalisco. Ezequiel Rivera says, have you heard of youngster Chef Sui? Um, I couldn't stand him at first, and then I did one of his recipes, and good lord. I know who you're talking about. Hey, the vato gets down, eh? His food's bomb, huh? I got into it in the Fresno County Jail. Did you, Robert? In high school, Maena. Girls used to always tag up my binders, that deep south side molesto locas, and then tag my name. Hey, the deep is, is the deepest with business. Almost mean Gene Okerlin. 
How about the Ultimate Warrior, brother? Hey, so my ex-mother-in-law, bro, she met the Ultimate Warrior. She used to work at a at a hotel, right? You know, one of those nice hotels. It was called the W. My prima works there now in Newark, but she uh she said he came in and his ID said Warrior. That he really changed his name to the Ultimate Warrior. That was his real name. I gotta go. I wanted to come and say hello. Thank you, Tater Todd. I appreciate you go so much. ECW was my shit back in the days. Dylan, man, I fucks with ECW. Macho Man all the way. CEO of Annoying Trolls was cracking. Hey, wow. Outlaw Feminist is, she's with the big boy clips. She said, I ain't going with the little clips. I'm going with the big boy clips. Thank you, girl. I appreciate you, man. Damn. Thank you so much. You don't even know. Nick said, what's up, Gunner and Blue? Hey, Nick is in the house. He said, what's up, Blue? Uh, SSA, I actually have some Fresno homies. They moved to North Fresno. They're Crips. And I have a few North Daniel homies that kick it with them. Yeah, I got a primo out there in North Fresno right now, man. Brisket or barbecue? Ooh, B, that's the key to my heart. I like a brisket. A good brisket goes, right? Gunner, have you ever watched that promo when Macho Man turned on Hogan was what he said he wanted to see Madness was on one? Yeah, yeah, he was on a great one, bro. He said, I see lust in your eyes. Lust, Hogan. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie, though. When he picked up Elizabeth on the shoulder, she was looking good in that Mega Powers outfit. He said, tag my binder. No, you didn't. Joanna remembers them days. Hi, huh, Joanna. Back in the days when everyone used to tag their binders and shit, Daniel Gondola says these youngsters don't know about the Iron Sheik or am I just hella old? Yo, so before the Iron Sheik started to smoke crack cocaine with Jake Roberts, right? That vault of the Iron Sheik was as real as they got, bro. He won in the Olympics. I think he was a bronze medalist for Iran. He was the real deal. Tony handled that shit like real men with respect. Is he 310? Absolutely, bro. I, I believe they both did. Um, you're talking about the fight, right? Um, when you pull up, bro, that right there tells the tale, you know, just pulling up is half the battle. It's just like going to work, bro. The hardest part of going to work is waking up. Ultimate warrior was a trip. Yeah. That was all fucking yayed out. La Parka was the, isn't it? La Parka was different. That was that a bubble gut and still one. They didn't even barbecue over here in my, in my smoky voice. They didn't. Carne asada tacos or quesadilla. Carne asada off the top. If it's made right. North Fresno is motherfucking crazy. I say, yeah. Shout out to Pleasant Street. The gun going hard in the paint. There's my fucking Pedro Chata right there. What's up, Valentino Gomez? Proud of you, boy. Been riding with you as that bulldog. Ruh, ruh. That's right. Shout out to the Pedros, man, out there in Fresnal. I need them barbecue ribs all day. I say, I get down, bro. My barbecue rib game is immaculate. Hey, I made some ribs the other day. I made candied barbecue ribs, bro, and I could only eat one because I got diabetes. Them motherfuckers. Bro, icky, sticky, bomb. You have a lot of classic videos. You help bridge the gap. A lot of people don't know. We aren't that different. We just grow up miles apart. 818 Southside, absolutely, brother. Did you tap in with my video today, man? I just put it straight out there, and I said, bro, you know, um, we all got to get our shit together. Straight up. The Outlaw Feminist is going to check out your channel after this live. Vasquez Familia, she's as real as it gets, bro. Go tap in with Blue. She's uh, You'll be pleasantly surprised, brother. And not surprised because of her content, because she's got that on lock. But I believe that... Um, I mean, it's just a pleasant situation. What's good, player? Demi Almares, the fun lover. San Jose is a gangster. San Jose is gangster as fuck, though. Say, I give my respect to the Norteños and Bulldogs coming from Osi Califas. You know what, eh? Um, I talked to my homeboy from San Jose today. We chop it up every day, once a day. And I talked to my homeboy from Fresno every morning, right? Hey, it's crazy, right? Because those are rivals, those two towns. And I talked to one from each every day. And um, my homeboy from San Jose is a good friend of mine. He said, hey, he says, San Jose's up right now, bro. He says, North and South is, it's up, homes. They're, they're going crazy right now. Daniel Enriquez is gone. It's online again. What do you think is going to be the next POTUS? Um, who do I think is going to be the next president? Is what you're saying? You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, Trump. Did you ever watch Lucha, Me- Lucha Mexicana, bro? Yes, I did. I love Mexican wrestling. It's my favorite. What's up, homie? Gunner, pun, 503. I see Vasquez Familia, 415. I appreciate the look. Love and respects, man, from Blue. Damian Almaris is one rib. One rib, bro. You know what I'm saying? I felt like Adam when he gave Eve her shit. Hey, bro, I fucking, I had that rib as a little, a little, uh, uh baby back. Mother, I, I ate that motherfucker like, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to get mine on. I, I chewed on that motherfucker like I was swishing pulling oil for a long ass time to get that flavor. Try candied bacon. You know who told me about that back in the days was Dubs. He told me candied bacon is the bombest shit. Uh, candy ribs. Hey, Vasquez Familia, them motherfuckers were bad, homie. The way I did them. Everyone go get Kinder seasoning and sauces. Bay love gun smoke. A one eight salsa says I missed it today. Uh, was caught up following up on Ryan Garcia's progress. Hey, A one eight Southside, it's all good, bro. You know, like I know, bro. 
the vat is going to be there and handle his business, barbecue or of mildew uh, or mildew. Yeah, I'm going to fuck with barbecue before mildew. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to get gangrene. The gang stuff got to stop and all the raza needs to take over Khalifas. I agree, man. Outlaw Feminist, what's your YouTube channel? It's the Outlaw Feminist channel, Ezekiel Rivera. Make sure you guys all, there's 175 of you in the building, man. Make sure every one of you guys goes and taps in with uh, Blue from the Outlaw Feminist channel. And uh, go show some support, man. She does bomb-ass lives. Her lives are popping. Um, just her topics in general, man. And even if you're a lady, I, I believe um, she's your style of woman. You know, a very independent, smooth thinker that is educated. And, you know, if you're into motorcycles, well, I'll be. You know, she knows a little bit about, not a lot of it about that life too. You need to come to Texas, get some of that Tejano food. I fuck with Tejano food, bro. I'll be out there in El Paso. Hey, Tejano food's bomb, bro. Don't get it twisted. You know what, where the food tasted like caca, though? Don't get mad at me and unsubscribe, but New Mexico is different. I'm just going to say that right off the top. Besides the green chili, the green chili's bomb. Mm. I went to a taco truck in New Mexico and spit it back at him. Macho Man drove across the highway. Yeah, he had a heart attack, bro. Hey, what's up, Sag Daddy 916? What's up with it, bro? Spend a minute. How you doing, sir? Your voice is coming out 1,000 miles an hour. I don't know what happened, brother. Is it? That's just how I talk, John Brennan. I'm fast with my reactions, bro. You want me to slow it down for you? Uh, Roberts is going for Ryan Garcia, likewise. What is candied ribs, bro? <clears throat> it's just ribs, bro, but the way I put the brown sugar on them and in the, the different layers that I put on, that motherfuckers look like candy apples when I was done with them. I don't agree with feminism, brother. Um, who said anything about feminism, brother? I agree with equalism, right? I agree that men and women are both equal. Um, do you remember a baseball player for the Giants named Candy Maldonado? No, but I knew a chick named Candy Maldonado. I used to bone the shit out of her. She was bad. As long as you didn't say Austin, brother. <laughs> hey, Gun, Big Mister got a podcast. You check it out. Um, I have. I have. Bosque Familia. I seen he had a BFD on there, right? It's all right, you know, doing their thing, trying. Our Chile is some other type of trip. Yeah, Hulk Hogan, that feminism isn't going to work for me, brother. This is Jay Ma. Uh, what's up, Gun? Can you give a shout out to my son, Julian? Hey, Juan, got you. Hey, what's up, Julian? Do good, man, because your dad ain't playing. With a name like Juan, you know what I'm saying? That's Juan in a million. Shout out to uh, Julian. Julian, what's up, man? Tell him you don't talk fast. He just listens slow. Now, I can't disrespect the gente like that, Valentino. But uh, I do talk pretty fast, bro. It's always been my thing. I, sh I wiggle, bro. Why do you think I get so many tortas and have so many different baby mamas? So that's good because I get my move on and Hoover groove on. The tacos in LA and TJ are ultimate level, says Vasquez Familia. You ain't lying. Wild sounds of the scale. Trump or Biden, says Robert. Uwe, Trump is killing the Super Tuesday gunner. There we go. I let a hey, Ralph Martinez uh, answer that question, Robert. What's good, Gunner Cuba? Saludos, loco from Nuevo Mexico. Tommy Montoya, what's up, brother? How you doing? My boy Muzz says, what's with all this feminism talk? I thought we were all pro-lesbian. <laughs> That's right, bro. Trump 2024. I see Chicanos for Trump, says the funk lover. My uncle took my light bulb on the fridge. Did, nah, bro. Hey, trip out. What about my Theo did the same thing before, bro? What about I opened it and I couldn't see my milk? Because, hey, I ain't going to lie. My, my, my thing that I do all the time, bro, is on the late night, I like to have a bowl of Captain Crunch. Even with diabetes. Fuck it, I cheat, right? I love a bowl of Captain Crunch late night while watching The Walking Dead, right? It's my trip. So uh, I'm going to do that tonight. So fucking um, one time I'm, I'm, I'm like, ooh, I want some Captain Crunch. And I went in my shit, bro. And my uncle was in the bathroom for a long time. This is back in the days, right? That about the smoking out the focal, right? He was, he was fucking in that motherfucker, getting his getting his groove on. I said, hey, motherfucker, you took the light out the fridge? He said, yeah, bro, I didn't think it was that serious. I said, it is that serious, bro. Uh, I'm trying to get fluent because I work with Mexicanos. I do better than most huevos. Thought, thought I would at work. Patrick, um, my Spanglish is slow, slow motion. Hey, that's a serious question. Is taxes coming late? I don't know. Fun lover, I can't call it, bro. You know what I'm saying? I always file mine's on the deadline, bro, because I ain't going to lie. I have to pay hella money. Nuevo in the house tonight. Shout out to Nuevo Mexico, man. Fruit Loops or Frosted Flakes? Frosted Flakes. That's it straight up. Frosted Flakes. Go, bro. What's up, homeboy? Just listening to you while on my run. Ed Liner. What's up, man? We got 162 real ones in the building. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys. Mm. 
Oh, brother, that 10 to 2, that 10 to 2. Hogan, he was getting his motherfucking percolation on him. He, hey, he dropped his apparatus, so he went straight to the focal, bro, and he was getting his, his groove on. I opened the bathroom and woke wide awake. Hey, for some reason, when I opened the bathroom and my, my deal came out, I didn't want Captain Crunch no more. I wanted a Mountain Dew. That's crazy, huh? What's your favorite YouTubers right now? Joe Rogan, um, JD Delay, Outlaw Feminist, and Dubs Channel. Those are those are my go-tos right there. I like to smoke chicken thighs, smoke them two hours, and take them off and heat up some sweet baby raised barbecue sauce and brown sugar once it's warm. Hit it with some Coca-Cola. Oh, man, Sag Daddy's putting you guys up on game. Dunk the thighs and put them back for one more hour. 10-5 a key, pura. Bosca's Familia says Frosted Flakes. Yeah, they're great, bro. They ain't lying. When the tiger says they're fucking great, he ain't bullshitting you. They are great. But look, Frosted Flakes got to be the real ones, though, bro. All that fake Frosted Flakes, the generic ones, they don't taste the same, eh? Can you get Frosted Flakes in prison? You can in the package. So they give you Frosted Flakes like once a week, uh, just cereal. Just fucking, you know, with your with your tray, homes. Um, but they're the generic ones, you know, the ones that come in the big old tubs. But you can order the little boxes, depending where you're at. You can order the little boxes, bro, of cereals. And sometimes the big boxes as well. Um, a lot of it's generic, but the little boxes, they give you the real Frosted Flakes. Uh, your deal was with Joker. Your deal was with Joker. Joker twisting the pipa. I don't know. I don't know who Joker is, bro. JD Delay is real also. Absolutely, Jeremy. I fuck with him tough. Frosted or plain? To be honest with you, I like plain better and adding my own sugar. Um, yeah, cornflakes, homie. Saturday mornings, Daniel. You remember Captain Caveman and and uh and all that? I remember Candy Maldonado. Why? What happened? It's the seg daddy 916. Nah, nah, the homie was asking me about Candy Maldonado, the baseball player. I said, no, I knew a chick. Her name actually was Adelia Maldonado, but we used to call her candy. It tasted like candy too, literally. You know I'm saying it tasted like Twizzlers. Cinnamon Life cereal for me, brother. A Cinnamon Life is good. Mikey eat it. Kellogg's. Yes, I'm a Kellogg's type of person. I've been tripping out on the Joe Rogan topics. I've been catching up on the pyramids. Yeah, I fucks with Joe Rogan tough, bro, because he does a little bit of everything, and I appreciate that. Uh, I catch your next live gun. Got to work. A.E. Guard. All right, brother. Lived in Merced when I was younger, went to East Campus for half a year, then moved back to Delano. I moved it there, though. The Heinas there were bomb. Ruben, the wind blows in Merced, huh? There are some bad ones, but, hey, to be honest with you, bro, depending upon your age, I probably boned all their moms. I'm just being honest with you, and I ain't trying to even sound like a hypocrite. Put some bananas in there. Ooh, we Going to elementary school in San Francisco, teachers would ask me if I was related to Candy Maldonado. Is that right, J-Ma? Um, any stories about Merced NSP during your time? Northside Pau on Pau Yeah, bro. Got a couple stories. We we actually got along with them, bro. They used to kick it with us in the, in the West Side Merced Original Bloods. Um, and the old school McNamara Lynch mob. Um, they used to fucking function out of a little spot right off Denver, bro. And, and uh, right off Loft, bro, Denver Street. And they used to function in these little apartments. Not little. They were called um, the... Um, Damn, I was thinking Merced Commons. That's on the West. They were called the uh, Meadows, Meadows Apartments, bro. Uh, Rogan's my role model. Yeah, I fuck with Rogan. I had a friend that used to add peanut butter to a cereal. Nah, hey, hit a one if you like peanut butter Captain Crunch. Ooh, that shit goes. Bananas and Frosted Flakes, that shit goes. I just told my daughter to make me a sopa, uh, uh, to make me a bowl of cereal. Vasquez Familia, hey, that, right after I get off this, bro, I'm going to call uh, my torta and eat a bowl of cereal. What's going on with Frost? Ah, Laugh. He, uh, he went on the live with uh, with Rotom Radio, Tony A, and they got into it, and he called Tony A a bitch and a punk and a piece of shit and all kinds of other wild stuff. Tony handled it like a G, though, bro. Tony uh, Tony was like, you know, hey, calm down, bro. You know, act your age. Just, let's act civilized, right? And Frost just kept going off, bro. It sounded like a 14-year-old man on his period, right? So he kept going off, and finally fucking Tony goes, look, I'm going to do something for the Raza. And he hung up and he goes, that was for La Raza. Don't, don't. Uh, one, when I was pre-diabetic, uh, Captain Crunch gets soggy quick. I smash it quick, bro. It doesn't last around this camp. What's wrong with, Sa with Sakura? Ain't nothing wrong with Sakura. Um, I had a friend at one time. His mom dated Candy Maldonado and he came to spend the night in Martinez. And she told him the house was haunted. And he was like, bullshit, it is in the middle of the night. <laughs> 
Frost has dementia. I think he does. Hope. I think he has a. Yeah, he has something, bro. I'm saying about the things he's running for president. Call that torta, says Vasquez Familia. I prefer certain soggy cereal, a uh, certain cereal soggy, Jamal. There are some, and you know, I like, uh, remember back in the days, the shredded mini wheat, but the big one. Remember that one? That motherfucker was good, bro. You let that motherfucker get soggy, it hits. Worst cereal was Honey Schmacks. You didn't like Honey Schmacks, Junior? They get all stuck in your teeth and shit, huh? Frost old ass liable to blow a head gasket acting like that. Yeah, he was acting real high ish bro. I just didn't. You know what I'm saying? It's the Rasa don't act like that. Big Jerry said, hey, homie, are you backing Steve Garvey? L.A. Locos. Steve Garvey? You're talking about the baseball player, eh? You ever heard Mexican power by proper dose? Absolutely. Mexican power. That's the shit, bro. Cold game. Cupboard doors was opening and slamming closed. He started crying and ran out the house. He never came back. He said, pussy ain't work. None of that. Ryan Garcia with the talking about recently crazy um, I think Ryan's going to be all right. I think this is just to sell the fight, man. You know, tune in, man, because I think everyone's going to be pleasantly surprised from what I hear. Cocoa Pebble Smack, love them. I like Fruity Pebbles better, though, bro. Fruity Pebbles are the shit. Mm. Oh, wait. I'm trying to get my shoulders back. I ain't never had them. Demi Lamares, Two Way Dave, Sack is Trash, Gun Smoke, Honeycombs Go. I fucks with Honeycombs Tough, too. Was it because of him supporting SPM? Nah, you know, um, I think, so, to, to break it down for you, bro, hey, what's up, Sarah? How you doing, girl? I like Honey Bunches of Oats. Those go, too. I got off a call with my uncle who's doing time right now, and he's only making 92 cents, and that ramen is 40 cents. Ooh, wait, that's an ugly situation. Buenas noches, Vasquez Familia. Enjoy your cereal, homes. Gunner, don't live in CA. Steve Gar Garvey, ready for senator. I don't, bro. I don't live in California, homie. Um. You know, I live in Washington at this point. So, oh, Steve Garvey is running for senator. Um, yeah, bro, I don't, I don't know what's going on. Is he, is he Democratic or Republican? What you know about Cookie Crisp? It would uh, rip the roof off your mouth. Uh huh. That's why my mouth's all fucked up right now. I got a big old caja of it right now. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, though. Oh, what about French Toast Crunch? You ain't never had French Toast Crunch. I'm good, and you? I'm, I'm actually real good, Sarah. I feel good. Feel great. I ate good earlier. Um, yeah, Showbiz said he heard Ryan looking sharp in training. Hey, A1A Southside, let's just say Ryan, he's got a, 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 a nace up his sleeve, bro. Two-way day says Republican. Yeah, go Garvey. <laughs> nah, Cinnamon Churros Crunch changed it for me. Was it bomb, Kamai? Hey, Bones from Merced, does he do tattoos? Um, it depends on what Bones you're talking about, bro. It depends on what Bones you're talking about, but yeah, bro. The one I know he does. I think it's probably the same one, homie. When are you doing another cooking video? This week, bro. Um, maybe mañana. Gunsmoke said, Wes hooped his cereal before he ate it. Damn. That was that fucking like three different size spoons. They just pull them. Oh, that's my. That's for salad. That's for salad. What did kids? Uh, we the same age. Remember that, Mr. T cereal? Oh, my goodness. Gucci. What about the E.T. cereal, though? You don't know about the E.T. cereal, Gooch. How much did ramen cost us when you were locked up, Holmes? Uh, $4 a caja. Used to be four, four a caja, then it went up to six. A.C. Abar says, I'm down with the Honey Nut Cheerios. Good for the Cora. You ain't lying, bro. That motherfucker smack a lot. Hey, they smack a lot. What did Kid Frost do now? Ah, he's running this, his whole neck. He went on to a Rotom Radio, Sarah, and got into a big old argument on the phone with the uh, with Tony A and, you know, just acted real childish, man. I don't know what his problem is. He got issues. Maybe he's got a new album coming out. He's trying to promote it. Gun, you had me cracking up at work today. Thank you, Damon. Jay Rivera says, what about the old school up for Kaboom cereal? Oh, bro, you, what you know about kicks? You talking about kicks? We're going to need a video on the knockouts during a hit. <laughs> hey, uh, two-way Dave, I got you. Or the Ghostbuster cereal gun, that shit was good. That shit was good. The Ghostbusters, that went. How many soups were in the box? 24, Holmes. Omar approves. Says Kamai. I used to smack the shit out of some kicks only because all Wick allowed us to. Spend some the on my daughter. Hey, real talk, bro. Six gallons of milk, a thing of peanut butter, a can of pork, and fucking uh, gang of kick cereal on my pad. They said Steve Garvey is running for office. Hey, what's good? Pistola. Oh, shit. Desculpa, me, homie. <laughs> How about when cereal had prizes inside? Remember that shit? 
Hey, my mom used to be like, get your fucking forearm out of the box. I was in that motherfucker digging. Me and my brother used to go at it. I used to, I used to shut the fuck up. I'm getting the fucking the glow in the dark ring, homie. You know, is it mandatory to hoop as a northerner? It's mandatory to hoop. All right, look. North, south, white, mandatory. That's what I'll say. Count Chocula. Yeah, that shit was good. I wasn't a booberry type person. I was Count Chocula all the way. What's good with you, Guns? Uh, it's your boy Stretch to St. John's P-Town. Stretch Garcia, what's up, man? Shout out respects, bro. Shout out to that, you know, St. John's area, that north side of P-Town. I see you, bro. What about that nun, honey? Hey, Stretch Garcia, I remember when I used to live out there, I used to go to a spot called King Burrito. They still got it? Or King Tacos or King Burritos. No, I think it's King Tacos. It was bomb. What about the nut and honeys? Yeah, I fuck with the nut and honeys, and I'll be nutting and honeys too. Kix was the only government approved cereal. Shit, bro. The feds, hey, the feds were cashing out over that, huh? I seen Red Supreme had them, um, and you and Doves on his live talking. Says Robert C. I seen Red Supreme had them. Who are you talking about? What are you talking about, brother? Good. Uh, we were poor. We had that Bonnie Hubbard cereal. Yeah, bro. I remember, bro. What? I remember we had to drink fucking, we had to eat kicks with powdered milk or the canned milk. Oh man, times were rough. Times were rough. A spoonful of milk with water, bro. That shit tasted nasty. Ruben, I was riding that as gun read your comment. Can't forget the honeycomb hideout. Man, shit, I'm ready to ride out. I always added some graham crackers to my leftover cereal. What about the Teddy Graham cereal? That shit hit too, huh? The chocolate ones? Kid Frost is sold. We knew the Golden Grams Bear when he was a cub. <laughs> Hey, he knew fucking uh, the giraffe when the giraffe fucking was a kid, could be a kid. Uh, it's mandatory if you want to survive, plain and simple, says Daniel Gonzalez. Absolutely. I mean, um, you're going to hoop something, bro. I'd sit here and lie to you if I said I never hooped a fierro, a fucking pack of cigarettes, all kinds of other shit, man. Um, it just is what it is, man. You know, Esu, when you was locked up, you used to take out some of your money if you worked. What do you mean? Take out some money if I work, bro. So it goes on your books, homie, and then I spend it on cantina. Um, I didn't make much. I always worked in the kitchen, bro, as a porter. Hey, bro, that fool Johnny got me hot, bro, last night, bro, about doves. Uh, you got your back. He got hella hot when he mentioned you talking about living somewhere three states over. Like, what the fuck, fool? You trying to blast the gun? Ah, stretch. I don't know what the fuck that dude's talking about, bro. Um, That was some good-ass black, right? At the same time, man, you know, I dropped the video, Uh, you know, expressing what... Look, I can... You guys want to hear what it's really about, bro? I'll tell you what it's really about. You know, I ain't bullshitting, man. If you guys want to hear real life, you know, who paid him and why he did that, bro, I could tell you. I don't give a fuck. You ever drink wheat germ with milk? Have not. Was it called carnation or something like that? Carnation milk, homie. The red and white can. I remember cereal and water days, brothers. Man, the struggle was real, brother. Right out the fucking sink, huh? I remember one time my mom was like, hey, that's all we got. I was like, fuck it, run it, right? And she didn't, she was washing dishes, so the water was hella hot. She filled that shit up with hot water. That Captain Crunch burnt the shit out of my roof, right? Luis went, this is Merced. You ain't lying. French toast or pancakes? French toast, homie. Pancakes with peanut butter in prison, though. All white labels with just a picture of a cow, fish, or a pig. Ezekiel, he's taking it back. Merced is in the house. Luis went, this. Shout, Thundercats or Transformers gun. I'm going to roll with Transformers. I remember standing in line with my abuelita for that government cheese and powdered milk. You feel me? AC Barra, shit, I, I I know what that feels like, bro. How the fuck you fit a pack of cigarettes up there? Hell nah. Well, bro, you didn't just stick the whole pack in your asshole, bro. You uh, we would break the frajos down, bro. Or you take the cigarettes and when you bundle them, the non filters they're only about that big, bro. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know, to the where the sun don't shine. I remember that all white with black letters, powdered milk, and the big bars of cheese, white cans of pork. Remember that? The cans of the white cans with a peanut on it. Is it peanut butter? And then the pork, bro. I'm old school, bro. We had silver cans with a pig on it. And it just said pork. And then the beef, it said beef. Hey, I ain't going to lie. I had a homeboy named Lex, right? He was Chicano and black. And uh, his jefita was white. How that came out? Hey, he used to be like, I'm Mexican and black, but his mom was white. I, I don't know how that worked out, right? But anyways, we're at his pad. I remember distinctly as a kid, bro. And he broke out the can of beef, shredded beef. And he was like, my mom's going to make tacos right now. And I was like, ah, oh, bro, I ain't trying to fuck with that shit. He was like, hey, those to this day, those are the best tacos I've ever eaten in my life. She got down on me. I said, damn. 
white cans of chicken. I remember a couple of nights we had salt and pepper soup. Damn, Alan. That was struggling right there. You know what I mean? That's that's a struggle right there. Is it when you were locked up, homes Was cigarettes still allowed? No. No, cigarettes weren't allowed, bro. The government cheese, nothing like it. Boom. Valentino Gomez. Yeah, it's bomb, bro. I ain't going to lie. Austin Glimmer says, one time I got in a squabble with the Cambodian blood from Stockton because he hit my blunt and spit was all over. And I said, you slobbered all my blunt. And that was it. He said, what's up, lad? And that was it. It was on. Motherfucker, what you say, blah? <laughs> right? Oh, shit. King Burrito. Hell yeah, homie. That's still around on Lombard. That shit's bomb, bro. They used to have bomb menudo there on Sunday. It's just a little tiny spot, but it, it used to crack. What's up? New to the channel. Much respect from Canada. Uh, Rob Coombs. I see you. How you doing, man? I appreciate the support. Thank you so much. They used to have Ninja Turtle cereal in the 90s. Yeah, I couldn't fuck with it, man. Splinter looked like it was a Chirujo on the box. Ranch style beans. I still fuck with them, bro. Salt and pepper soup. Ezekiel's laughing at that one. That's some, hey, that's some new school, old school shit, huh? Government grilled cheese hits different. It does, bro, because the cheese don't melt. You know what I mean? What about bread that doesn't toast and, and, and cheese that doesn't melt? Yeah, you know, even when the roaches don't even eat it, that's when fucking the struggle's real. Bro, we had food that the roaches would walk around and just keep on going. They'd be like, nah, I'm cool off that peach, bro. You could have that. You know what I mean? SC, you find the rest of them jerseys for that collections video. I got you, Funk Lover. I got them. They're all right there, bro, in the in the other room. It would trip you out if you see my closet. I right, guns, tell us the truth about Johnny. Oh, you know, I get sidetracked. A uh, truth is, bro, that fucking, uh, I believe that weirdo fucking uh, Mark paid him, bro, um, some money, bro, to slander myself as well as doves. Because you got to understand that if you noticed in that video, Johnny kept saying, he was using Mark's videos without asking. He was using Mark's videos without asking. Like, who gives a fuck, right? He uh, does reacts to different content creators. That's part of his, his smaller channel is a reaction channel. So as content creators, we have a community and most people ain't going to trip, bro. You know, right now I'm going through a struggle. What's up, Heather? Right now I'm going through a struggle on my channel because I got reused content. So I use someone else's a little piece of their... Not like some other country creator, I stole their content, but I made a little short, you know, out of uh, a little clip and I got reported on it and um, and they shut my shit down for 90 days. You know, they didn't shut my channel down. They demonetized it, bro. So it makes no sense to drop anything over here. I could focus on this channel right now, which is cool. I'm not worried about it. In 90 days, I'll be back on, you know, Gunners Collective TV, the motherfucking shit don't stop. Um, Hey, all the yards are 50-50 now, says Bay Area. That's right. But yeah, so so Dubs was doing his little videos and uh, he did a couple about Johnny and um, and everything was good in the hood, bro. But I believe that, you know, ever since then, here's something that Dubs won't tell you ever since then, you know, usually. So here's the here's the get down. I'm gonna give you guys game. So when we uh, yeah, Dubs always encouraged people to go watch the channels. He reacts to and definitely and deliberately doesn't show the whole video so people can go watch them. Exactly. So real life, bro, we. um. When we upload our videos, there's certain steps and things that you have to do to get it just right, you know, and, um, you know, usually your video goes green. It's ready to go after, you, you know, after you go through the stages. And for some reason, the channel that Dubs had did those reactions to, it, they always gave him hard, a hard time. He would call me like, hey, bro, it's yellow again, yellow again. Um, and so he couldn't drop it. You know, they would just give him a hard time and, and he was being reported by someone and we kind of figured it was that dude uh <clears throat> um mark you know from uh, uh soft white underbelly but didn't want to throw nothing on no one not with no paperwork right and after last night that kind of confirmed powder milk peeling the red tape off the baloney so one of the legends of my hood 18th street portland chapter well his jefita owns king burrito they know my familia since like the 90s and hell yeah it should be smacking them chili cheese fries uh, yeah, I know who she is, bro. She was an old lady. Hey, was your homeboy the one all tatted back, bro? The bigger dude? The dark, bigger dude? All tatted? Is that your homeboy? Um, like Pac, you'll say, uh, you must, uh, uh, you're going to buy me, bury me, tell them motherfuckers I'm back. Hey, Gun, what's up, Sack Trash? Ruben says, what's the bombest comida you ever uh, concocted in the pinta? Was it a spread or something else? Nah, homie, my celly used to make burritos, fried burritos, um, they were bologna burritos, homes, or I mean my ex hood, but yeah, dog, it's still around and it's gonna be that shit be packed, homie. Yeah, so um my one of my cellies, he was an OG 
fuck. These bologna burritos were fucking bomb, homie. Cali Raider said, is Mark, is, is Mark a wood? No, he's a, he's a white man, um, but not a wood. Uh, is this live going to end when you reach 200 likes? Not nah, J-Mo. We're going to be on here to the motherfucking sun don't shine no more. Oh, storytelling. Johnny be on a sick one. Yeah, he does. He gets he gets on one, it seems. I said, do you have any Jordan 13s? I do, brother. Um, what's up? Anyways, the homie used to take his hot pot, right? And he had cracked it down and he used the inside of the hot pot as a, as kind of like a hot skillet to fry. Oh, we used to take the bologna. They used to give bologna in these little packs. And he would take a few pieces of the bologna and, bro, he'd chop it down. He'd throw it in butter. He'd throw like half, like some butter from the kitchen. He'd throw that bacon, I mean, that uh, bologna. He'd fry it in there, bro. And he'd, he'd hit it with rice, the bags of rice, steamed rice. He'd put all these little different seasonings. Ah, oh, bro, them burritos were fucking different. Yeah, he was a badass cook. He was doing all, he was doing all day. He's probably locked in right now still. 13s are the best. Got the purple and black ones. Yeah, 13s go, bro. I, I'm my favorite are fives, threes, and ones, but 13s go. I like 11s as well. Yeah, he broke. He's mad. He lost his chance and his opportunities in life. Period. Who is a uh, uh, stretch? He lost his chances, opportunities in life. Period, man. What size is they? I said, let me let me buy them off you. I don't know, bro. If your foot's as big as mine, homie. But what size do you wear? Next time you give a tweaker a bag, make him sign an NDA. <laughs> says Isaiah. Y'all spoke in CYA. Did you hear of Skinhead's group called Bash? Sounds familiar, brother. Um, but I can't say that I have uh, for sure. So Mark did what Adam Sixteen did to C Mac and talk about China Mac. Pretty much. Pretty much. I think he. Yeah. Pretty much, bro. Cash dude out so dude would talk shit. And, you know, it's unfortunate, man. I mean, what did we do wrong but but try to raise some money from someone that's in an unfortunate situation, you know? That money was all love. No strings attached. Not one string attached. It wasn't done because of some heinous. Uh, bro, we never touched the money, man. We made sure that it went to a three-way party so that I was able to get to him as quick as possible. And, uh, bro, he started crying. When he was handed the money, there was a video. He was literally crying, bro. When the ask Kamai, he'll tell you, he was he was tears in his eyes, bro. He couldn't believe people would be that nice to him. And six months later, bro, um, you know, again, my name wasn't mentioned. Dub's name wasn't mentioned, um, but he kind of just beat around the bush, bro. And that's even worse when someone just beats around the bush. Just got an ESPN notice. Canelo Munguia May four. Charlo brother out. Good. Um, Again, man, I believe it should be Canelo Benavides, but Munguia, hey, I'm glad he's going to get his shine. I fucks with, fuck with Munguia tough. Charlo, caca. I saw that boxing match you had. You ever doing it again? Um, challenge Johnny. Nah, bro. Come on now. Johnny's old school, bro. I respect him. Hey, even people that talk shit about me, j Maul, doesn't mean I hate him. I'm, I'm more disappointed than anything, man. But I hope Johnny makes it in life. And that, you know, he finds the right route, bro, because what he's on now, bro, I'm sure ain't going to work out for him too long. You know, your legs fall off in that shit, that your flesh starts to fall off. Not that I'm making fun of him being broke, pero, uh, like he mentioned shit about broke situations. The homie guns, no mames, bro, you're funny when you drink. I seen that you got a, I seen that can you got there. Yeah, it's seven up. That's just my, hey, me, that's me off the top, drunk or not. Can you throw your email out there real quick? Yeah, bro. Um, let's see if I could do it right here. Wait up, bro. Where's this shit at? There it is, bro. Uh, Johnny disappointed you like the son of a gay pimp, says <laughs> Jayma. <laughs> Uh, bro, 13s, fives, and ones in that order. So, sack is trash. Uh, stretch says, damn, bro, that's going to be the inside of the century. Watch all of us followers make it such a trend that it's going to become a meme. So, Uso Gun is listening on the road, heading home from work. Hey, what's up, big Uso? What's up, my brother? You get that money, man? Get you, get you a nice little bag today, a little hefty, hefty cinch sack. I ain't mad at you, my brother, man. You know, and I'm glad that you're off work, bro. It feels good, man. You know, a hard day's work, man, for a hard day's wages. You know, you got your money, man. We got 168 and a bit of 194 likes. We've been stuck at 194 for a second or two, man. If you haven't hit that like, hit it for your boy. 
Um, just tap it. It ain't that hard. What's up, Heather? You guys did good. You tried. That's all you can do. Then you got to know when. No, it's a shame. God, well, thank you. Yeah, Heather, we tried, man. We didn't even try. We did, you know. Um, but, you know, I don't. It's like my Theo. My Theo was the exact same way. My Theo and Johnny are fucking the same type of individuals, right? Um, I wish I could show you. I just had a, a picture the other day of my Theo, man. I don't got it right here. It's in my other phone. And my other phone's in the living room, but <clears throat> my Theo, he was that type. No matter how much you gave him or what you gave him, he always wanted more. It was never enough, you know? And I think that's that dopey mentality. That's just real. I have a pair of DS5s right now, Quad 5-4 five, five, Players Edition. Oh, Daniel, those go, man. Is Johnny a Southerner? Um, He's from Southern California, Gooch. Uh, size 11, says Daniel Gonzalez. What up, guns? What you think of Ryan speaking on the elites and them forcing him to the woods? Uh, And them forcing him to the woods. Uh, I can't call it, Jonathan. I think everything is out there, man, just for speculation to uh, sell this fight. You know, the more drama... um the bigger star makes you, you know, it's going to get, it's going to pique more people's interest. I think this is all done. Um, so, you know, so we could talk about it. Uh, what do you think about the UFOs that the government or aliens are both? What religion are you going to, I'm a Catholic, uh, Mr. Polito. Um, and I believe there are aliens, bro. And I believe the government's been knowing about that. Dave Gibson's a gunner rules, gunner, uh, collective clips is best channel on YouTube, more addictive than peanut butter, pretzels, nuggets from Costco. Uh, them, they, 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 it's slightly close, but them motherfucking pretzels go, bro. Oh, hit that like button like the woods. Hit the coffee, brother. <laughs> hey, right now we just went up 20, 20 more likes. If I don't get it, somebody else will. That union plumber's money hits differently. Ooh, we big oos. Money like that? Bro, union plumber? That author right there is making more money than everybody on here. Mm. I have 100 pairs of Jordans since pun 503. That's right, brother. You need at least a hundo. You're in the hundred club. Come join it. I've seen real aliens, says Sackish Trash. I think I have too, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's just, I, I believe she had two pussies. I, I, I'm just saying. Thomas Harrell says he's Catholic, but cut, but but cause is causes first, says Thomas Harrell. You ever have the 14s? They actually had XIV sewn on the tongue. Yeah, they had XIV on the bottom as well in the little circle. I, I have the 14s. Um, and they weren't illegal. Hey, bro, nothing is addictive like sunflower seeds. That motherfucker, you, that that motherfucker's a chap your lips. You be spitting so much, huh? I'm late. I just got done making dinner. Made a ton of chicken taquitos. Mmm, Annette. I love some chicken taquitos with a little sour cream and guacamole. A little salsita homemade. Test. Uh, tell us your alien story. You know, uh, bro. Like I said, trip out, bro. I've seen some crazy shit. And I'm definitely, definitely going to switch up some of the uh, content here pretty soon and tell you guys a few little different things. And that is why I actually have the thumbnail made of that one already. Um, it was a trip. Let's just say that. Can you get sunflower seeds in prison? No, you can eat corn nuts though, bro. If they got sunflower seeds, that fucking yard would be covered, bro. I've seen a UFO, UFO before. I was on acid though. I swear that shit was real. Hey, what you know about this? I'll tell you guys a little story. Local uh, 669, that's right, Psycho Realm. Um, so I had a homeboy named Turtle, rest in peace, man, from 22nd and Bryant Street, eh? You know what I mean? San Fran, uh, uh, Michon. And uh, that was my celly right there, man. He was a cool-ass dude. And he and he, he used to talk funny. He used to say, I'm from Guatemala, right? <laughs> and uh, Guatemanteco, he used to always say. And so he's like, when he became my celly, he had like four months to the gate, you know? So he was getting out. He had done already like five, six years. So we're in that motherfucker chilling. I remember he used to be like, you can whatever, watch whatever you want on TV, homes. Just let's watch Pinky and the Brain. Because we only had one TV in our cell. Uh, you're in the Northwest. They say there's a lot of sightings that happen here. This is Patrick. Yeah, out in Washington, there is, bro. Love from Pacoima, no limit mini bikes. So anyways, the homeboy's like, hey, fool, fucking, um. And when I get out, is there anything you need? You know, some money, whatever. And I, shit, we always need money when we're, when we're youth authority, you know. And I was like, you don't got to bless me with nothing, bro, whatever. You know, that's what I always tell everyone. You ain't got to. If you feel like you, if it compels you to do it, then you do it. If you don't, it's cool anyways. He was like, hey, when I get out, I'm going to thin you from acid. That's how he talked, from acid, right? I said, bro, how do you expect to do that? He goes, don't worry, I'll figure it out. 
They call me Hamster from Hazard Street. La Primera lives. Uh, joking, not disrespect to no one. That's right. Hey, what's up, Danny G? You know, shout out to La Primera as well as Big Hazard Grande, homes. Um, so anyways, the bot to tell me like this. Watch out. I got you, homie, cover. All right, cool. So he paroles. It's like a month later. Pinky in the brain is all right. My favorite is Bert and Ernie. It's like a month later, and um, and I'm chilling, right? I'm just chilling in the cell, and it's me and my celly shorty from uh from Semsters or shorty from Casitas from Salas, right? Very well known, right? So me and Short they were chilling. That's my taita, and we're watching baseball, just chilling, and then fucking I get mail. The mail comes under my door, and it's a letter, and it's from Pinky Fernandez, fourteen fourteen Fourteenth Street from San Francisco, California. I said, hey, bro, what the fuck, right? I don't know, no Pinky Fernandez. And then it hits me, Pinky in the brain. And I go, what, San Fran? So I open it, and it's a letter, hey, hope you're doing good, homie, Pinky, right? That's all it said. And I was like, the fuck is that? You know what I mean? All that for that? I would have never did some shit like that. And I felt, the, and then, so I'm going to throw the letter, you know, on top of the table, and I feel the, uh, the uh, stamp, and I feel like a little lump in the stamp. And I look at Shorty and I go, oh, it's on, right? And he goes, what happened, bro? And I ripped open the stamp and there was a little cellophane little thing with four hits of acid. And I said, the homie came through. My boy said, that shit ain't real, fool. I said, are you down? He's like, fuck it, right? We popped two hits of acid each and let's just say we seen aliens. It was crazy. I remember this story left my ass. You told it on the old video. DJ, facts, bro. Facts, bro. Hey, the homie had a headphones and we went out to the yard, right? And there's like a little curb where you could like, where the cars would cruise around like the van to the building. And then there was a yard in the middle. We each had our own little independent yards, right? So we're in Tioga and uh, they would do it like this. So a building were connected. Tioga was this way. Sonora was that way. So they had their own shit. We had our own shit. And that's just the way the yard does work, right? So we're out there and the homeboy's bump. He's sitting there laughing, tears pouring down his face. I'm like, what's wrong, bro? And I'm all high, right? What happened? Right. And he's like, listen to this shit. And he puts the headphones on my head and it's bumping. Secret agent, man. <laughs> I feels all fucked up. Hey, I ain't even gonna lie. I slam dunk. I can't slam or shit. I'm six foot, but I can't dunk. You know what I'm saying? I ain't uh 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 Al, uh AI, right? I ain't fucking Allen Iverson. I'm gonna tell you right now, I swear. Ass snaps from uh, ass snaps from legend crip. I, I slam dunk. That shit gives you superpowers when you're high, or at least I believed I did. I'm going to hold that. I'm going to stay 10 toes down on that one. Hold the letter up to the light, and that's where some drops of acid were. Oh, I was licking the stamp and everything. Hey, we had 70 bags of chips in our cell. 70, right? Um, because that's how you did it in Y. You The bags of chips were a dollar. So if we went to Cantina, say I had like 100 on my books, the homeboy had 100 on his books. And other homeboys, we were all together. We all ate together, right? That's the way it was. And on that compa, there was like 30 or 40 homeboys. So we all get together and be like, hey, who has money? So we always bought the homeboys that didn't have money. We bought them something. You know what I mean? We made sure they were good. No one went hungry. That's how real homies do it. Nobody. They got, everyone got a case of salt bars. Everybody got bags of chips. Everybody got sodas. Everybody's eating, homie. You know, um, no matter what. So, but like if we have spreads coming up, they'd be like, all right, homeboy, you guys buy all the summer sausages and the beans. You guys buy all the queso. You guys buy all the sodas. You guys buy all the soups. You guys buy all the chips. So it was our turn to buy the chips. So we fucking bought um, 70 bags of chips, you know, $70 worth of chips. And the homeboy was so fuck is fucked up. He opened every bag of chips to taste them to make sure they, are all right, they were all right. <laughs> we had bags of chips everywhere. And then we were watching baseball, bro, and they kept throwing the ball, and I kept thinking it was going to hit me. But the pitch was going that way, but it looked like it was coming this way. We are fucked up, man. Hell yeah, Gunner, hilarious as fuck, man. Is that white and blue bull snapback 4-7 brand A? I got the same one. Which one you talking about, bro? Oh, the blue one in the back? Damn, you're all up in my closet. Huh? I said, um, nah, it's just a um, it's a snapback, homie. It's um Michelin and S. It's our size 11, or I'll buy a jersey, or we can get a trade or some shit. We can actually do the trade though. If you're down for the Jordans, uh, we can do the jersey. Hit me up, bro, on TikTok or something, brother, so we could talk, uh, you know, behind the scenes, bro. I might just bless you with something, homie. I don't need nada. I got a lot of hats, a lot of jerseys, brother, and I don't, you know what I'm saying? I could just bless you, brother. I don't, we don't need to do all that. How many northern factions are in Sacra? Well, there's one northern faction, homie. You're talking about Barrios? There's a, a lot of Barrios in Sacra, bro. 
Stretch is eight guns. I'm a split though. I got to get something to eat and call it a day, homie. It's been a nice seeing you through. Hey, that's right, brother. You have a good one, homie. You have a good one. Thank you so much. We got 169 still in the building like that. Where you guys at, man? John Joseph, I see you. Gabar Yala. What's up, man? Uh, Thomas Otto. That's right. Hugo, uh, Hugo Guzman. What's up, brother? Mm. Buenas noches. Stretch. Thank you, man. Uh, bro, my lady sometimes shake my head. I told her try tip. She got chicken thighs. <laughs> well, it was on sale, bro. You can't be mad. That's saving you money. The fun lover says you mess with LeBron and say, yeah, he's all right, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, he's a good ass player, bro. Don't get it twisted, bro. But I, I just don't like his attitude, bro. He thinks he's the shit and that stinks. This Modelo is going down good, homie. Yeah, that motherfucker sounds good, bro. I need a Modelo right now at this point, too. Ortizo, screw stone, Texas, man. Shout out Texas, man. Shout out Houston. Facts. I'm about to make some top ramen. What should I add to it? Oh, wait. So, man, add a little queso, little frijoles. Um, some Doritos, um, chicharron if you got it, and some jalapenos. Cool ass videos, bro, and some uh, hot pickles if you have it. What's been good, homie? Hope your nights are going blessed, man. Hey, Gabriela, yes, they are, bro. Thank you so much. Also from the AZ, what's up, brother? Thomas says Fresno's in the building. Mass is psycho realm. I see my brother, local 78, local 669. Fitters get that money, too. Get yeah, the pipe fitters be getting all that money. Triple J is good for Miami Heat. Uh, did you know Doritos are flammable? Are they? I got two bags in the kitchen right now. I light one on fire straight up. Set it bro. Damn, that's that fucking uh, uh doomsday preparation shit, huh? Now you're gonna make me go out and buy all kinds of bags of Doritos, you know, for uh, uh, for the Wessels. What size is them Jordans though? That's it. Are they 11? They're 11 and a half, brother. Hey, what's up, Gunner? How was your day today? Blessings to you and your familia. Hey, Mike, thank you, bro, for, ask, uh, for asking. It was great, bro. It was great. You know, now I got to get up early in the morning and go get my daughter a little something, something. Tomorrow's my youngest's birthday. Um, don't know what I'm going to get her, but it's going to be something good. She's turning six. Um, have you tried pupusas? Yeah, they're good, bro. Are you a Dodgers fan? Charlie, homie. Um, I'm a uh, San Francisco Giants and an A's fan, Bay Area. You know, but I fucks with the Dodgers. But, you know, those are the enemigas when it comes to baseball because I'm a Giants fan. But the Dodgers are good, bro. Back in the days. We got 106 so in the building, man, with 220 likes. Thank you, guys. Tell her happy early birthday for me. Thank you, Annette. Happy birthday to her. Thank you so much, Heather. Um, I had a bad acid trip, and a Dorito with the cape was chasing me. Did it catch you? Get her, Zebco33. What is that, Alan? That's right, bro, and happy birthday to your daughter, Gun. Thank you, guys, so much, man. Thank you, Mike. I appreciate that, brother. Happy birthday to her. I hope you enjoy the day with her. I am lucky, triple seven. I'm, You know what I'm saying? Tomorrow's her day, man. I'm just in it. Orderly Gun, happy birthday to your daughter. I'm a, a March baby also. Well, happy birthday to you as well, Gooch. Buenos noches, Gun. I got my final presentation for the quarter in school tomorrow before work. Got to go a ratos for now. Hey, Patrick, and the winner is, bro, go get that education on, bro, so you can get that money big. A's going to ve going to Vegas. Yeah, I think Vegas is trying to swoop up everyone. I am on Diamondbacks, Coyote Hockey, and Cardinals. That's right, Thomas. Fishing reel, says Alan. You watching the UFC 299 Saturday? Absolutely, man. Chito and uh, and that other Bawoso, right? Co part is I put my money on the other Bawoso because he's a knockout artist. Happy birthday to your little lady. Thank you, Adam and Cicio. Uh, also, gracias, carnal. My granddaughter turns 12 on the 13th. Wow. Getting big. They're getting big, huh, Annette? I have a 12 year old also. Ascending uh, mine from the trenches of Stockton. Shao! That's right, man. Shout out to Stockton, do so, Nina. 225 likes. Thank you. I ran into a fence and broke my nose. LOA flew over me. Eight gun. I hopped in late, though. What happened with Frost and the Wizard? So, uh, nah, bro. Um, Frost called into the Wizard for whatever reason, bro, and uh, went off. I mean, started calling them all kinds of bitches and punks and pieces of shits. And, and the Wizard was pretty calm and collected, bro. And he was like, hey, bro, calm down. You know, what's wrong with you, eh? And, uh, and Frost didn't even let him talk, bro. He just kept going and and, you know, there's going to be people that 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 don't like Tony that are obviously going to say Frost is in the right. My thing is, whether he's right or wrong, bro, uh, the way he acted and conducted himself, bro, is very unbecoming of a man his age and stature, right? So that's just how I feel about it. Doesn't mean I won't listen to Kid Frost songs. It just means now when I listen to him, I, I kind of take a, you know, a one-two step like Sierra. So, yeah, you know. It just is what it is, bro. You know, grown men acting like little kids. Happy birthday to your little one, bro. Thank you, David. Dave Gibson. 
uh, oh, yeah, everyone thinks she's my daughter. Then you looking good like that, Annette. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Grandma looking good. David Lopez says D-backs and Yankees fan here. Oh, bro, not a Yankees fan. Yeah, hey, do you know that uh, I met, what's his name, bro? Who's the one for the Yankees? Um, Not Dave Justice. He beats women. The other one, bro, Aaron Judge. So Aaron Judge went to Fresno State, homie, right? So trip out on this. So I have a homeboy, my homeboy fucking uh, Fabian. I've told stories about him. He was the one fucking that killed Saddam Hussein's sons and shit in the, in the Marines. So me and my homeboy are chilling in his front yard drinking a pistol. And uh, the homie's a nut. A fucking nut, right? Raider shield tatted on his face. Just crazy. And we're kicking back. And uh, his sister lives. So he's, he lives with his mom and his, his dad, you know, because he's all fucking catted out from the army. And now he got his own patty, got married and shit. But, you know, he was chilling, man. And we're kicking back right there. And his sister and his brother-in-law live right next door. Aaron Judge is a perro chato, says the goose. Yeah. So facts. So um, his nephew and his niece, I remember when they were in high school back in the days, you know, she was a cheerleader. Her fucking brother was a star wide receiver, but he also played softball, baseball. And so um, we're chilling right there in front of the pad, bro. And a car pulls up and it's his nephew and his nephew's going to his pad, his mom's pad, you know, he's. He's older now. He's in college. Big, big. He's half black and half Mexican. My homeboy's Mexican, but um, the homegirl Worm, which is his sister, she married a black bottle, right? And so fucking um, going to see his mom and dad and some other big old light-skinned cap gets off the car and tall, dude. And we're just kicking back and, and my boy Fave is like, hey, man, what, you can't give your Theo a hug or what? Fool, you too big for that? Oh, no, Theo, it's all good, right? And uh, he said, well, who's this cat, right? He said, oh, this is my homeboy, Aaron. Oh, what's up, bro? You go to Fresno State too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then later on, I remember when the fool got drafted, I go, ah, oh, I know that fool. I, I don't know him, but I met him. That was Aaron Judge. They say Aaron Judge knows fashion for them all. Oh, boy. Tony Finest, 25K of donations. So childless. Tony Finest, 25K of donations. So childless. I don't know what you mean. Stay woke always. What is that supposed to mean, bro? Marcus 1987 says, I believe that. Facts, bro. 100% facts. You know, it's just, it wasn't no big deal. I, I didn't know who the fuck he was. Hey, Gunner, I sent 20 to your cash app for your daughter for her birthday, brother. All love and respect. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. You didn't have to do that, homie. You didn't have to do that, man. Thank you, though, bro. Um, David Lopez, that's right. That's a trip. Um, yeah, bro, he's just, you know, at, at that time, he was still a kid, bro. He was in college, and no one knew he was going to be what he is now, worth fucking half a billion dollars, you know? Um, I sure wish I, he'd had money like that. Finessed 25K says lucky. Who finessed 25K? I ain't never finessed 25K, bro. I don't even know what 25K looks like, homie. I'm being real. You got to have to go get that lefty gun play because he did time with Tory Lanes because he's the one golfing and driving Maybachs. Shit, I'm lucky if I'm driving a Ford Explorer with an eye. I was mugged, beat up, knocked unconscious, and woke up Republican. Sack is trash. Me too. It's crazy. Essie, you ever had a buzz cut ever? Um, what do you mean? Like a fucking guy, a flat top. I never did that, bro. No shit. Really, bro. Yes, sir. David Lopez, J Moss's gun gun. Did you do time with renegade media? Any stories with or about him? No, I've never done time with that bottle, bro. Um, he's younger than me though. Um, I think he did. He did some time out there out of state in Arizona from what I hear. So he might uh, have done time with my brother. Cause my brother was out there during them times, my younger brother. Um, but as far as ever running into him or hearing about him, I, I have not, it doesn't mean anything. I just, I just, you know, it's a big system, bro. Big state. We just never ran into each other. Any thoughts on Ryan Garcia? Did you see what happened today? Yeah. My thoughts are, it's all bullshit, bro. Ryan to be all right. And he's going to win. Nah, they were saying Tony finesse 25 K in the last 25 K time. Oh, they're talking about, uh, uh, Tony a the wizard. I mean, that Chicano documentary shit. Something happened there. Then now that Gunner, just everything I do, it's from the heart, bro. Real recognized, real, bro. Gracias, bro. I appreciate that, man. I say, and I, and I see you got the Cowboy star there, bro. So coming from a Cowboy fan, you're going to make a motherfucker start to like the Cowboys a little bit. Thank you. He's six seven, says David Lopez. Who, uh, Aaron Judge? He's tall, bro. He's the, the, he's every bit of six seven, Holmes. Do inmates sit down peeing in California prisons, LA Dodger Blue? I don't know, man. Um, It depends on, uh, de depends on what prison they're in, right? Uh, Tony says he's side player. Um, yeah, bro. I don't, I don't know where that's coming from, homie. I ain't never, uh, I ain't never seen nothing like that. Tony A is cool, but I don't know. Shit ain't the same since years ago. S should be switching up. Exactly. Crazy. 
If your cell, if your cell is blind, if your cells is blind, yes. Says Jay Modern, get it, bro. I had a blind cellie. I just did a video about him. He was a good ass dude, though, bro. Cool, smart. Yeah, that dude was smart, bro. Very educated for not being able to read, right? A fishing pole. So sack is trash. Man, we're in the building. I'm going to get up out of here, though, Hector, because I know other people want to go live and I don't want to hold it down like in Vogue, man, and not let them get on, right? So, um, see? I got people getting at me already. Torta, and she waited. As soon as I said that, she said, you better get off, right? <laughs> That's right, bro. Hell yeah. Just one time for your mind, bro. I need to hear you say that. How about them cowboys? Thank you. Shout out to Mike, man. Uh, that's the torta. She was on it, bro. I told you guys as soon as I was done, she was gonna fucking get on me. Um, when I'm not just live tomorrow, you about to eat? Yeah, I'm gonna grub real quick some cereal homes, and then I'm gonna go get a. I'm gonna get the the whole back of uh, her head. I'm gonna cave the back of her head and sprinkle in the woods, brother. Later's about the when I'm not just. Hey, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for all the support. Um, thank you guys, man. It means a lot. I'll see you guys later, man. Let me see how I could do this. Okay. Bang, bang.